You know, honestly, I still can't even believe it. 10 years of Unreal and Gaming. That is insane. What's going on, everybody? Welcome back. My name is Unreal and Gaming, and this is going to be a very special gaming roulette video because this marks 10 years. 10 years of Unreal and Gaming on YouTube. This is my 10 year anniversary video, and I honestly thought I would never be making this to begin with. You guys have no idea how much time, how much energy, how much money I spent over these last 10 years putting into Unreal and Gaming and to have my voice be heard and to just come this far is just, it's mind blowing to me. So the Gaming Roulette series was actually started uh, because I wanted to go back and I wanted to kind of do what my channel was originally built off of, which was of course just playing games. And let me tell you, we're going to be playing some games, old games, new games, everything you guys want to see is going to be located down in the description box below. But I wanted to go on ahead and take a second here to say thank you so much. Um, I think in this video, I'm going to be talking about some real personal things and uh, just my journey. You guys you know for sticking bomb by for 10 years I never would have thought that to begin with when I first started this channel I said to myself I'm not even gonna make it past a thousand subscribers 10,000 subscribers whatever I just enjoyed playing games and here we are now although the foundation of this channel is no longer just solely built off games what a journey it was man lots of sacrifices lots of ups lots of downs and I want to thank everybody for just being here throughout all of it. I have so many people to thank, especially Super Saiyan Paul. He was one of the, originally known as the Cod Brothers Gaming, he was one of the only ones that put me on and he taught me so much back in 2012. Wow, am I getting old, bro. Jeez. But it's not just me. It's probably some of you guys that have been with me now for 10 years. You guys are just as old as I am. So I have so much gratitude for him uh, in putting me on and teaching me about capture cards and how to, you know, just fix your audio and all these wacky things because if you guys go back and watch my original videos, they're very cringy. They're bad. Like, they're just, they're bad, man. But over time, I've improved thanks to your criticism. I've improved as a creator and I have no idea, to be honest, what lies beyond the horizon 10 years from now. And man, I'm gonna be an old, but geez, we're all gonna be old. So it's kind of weird because it's like, all right, well, where do I see myself 10 years from now? 10 years ago, I never pictured any of this, right? But it's because of you, I'm genuinely grateful and I'm genuinely thankful for just everything, right? So I have nothing but love for you guys and I wanna thank you all so much for this. If you guys are new, hit that subscribe button, give this video a big fat thumbs up, follow me on Twitter and Instagram, those links will also be located down below as well. 10 years, I never would have imagined 10 years to go like this and it just, it flew by, right? See, if I can go back and tell myself 10 years ago what to do, how to function properly in terms of using proper equipment, back in the day I was using the Adaptech Game Bridge, which was a horrible capture card to begin with. I was using the uh, blue snowball microphone. I was actually using this SD stick of a mic. It was, if you watch my old videos, I kind of sound like this, it was, it was, it was bad. But here we are 10 years later. For those that have been with me for seven plus years, eight, nine, 10, thank you so much for literally everything. So I hope you guys sit back and enjoy, watch the entire video all the way through. And with that being said, let's not waste any more time and jump straight into the video. Okay, now this is going to be a bloodbath. We have Vegito that possesses the power of Super Saiyan Blue 3. We have Super Saiyan Rose 3 Goku Black and Super Blue Jiren Absorb having to battle against Limit Breaker Super Saiyan 4 Broly. We have Clone Murno and the original Murno. So this, this is not going to be as easy as I would want it to be because as you guys can see, I'm trying to hunt down Broly, but instead Murno just keeps getting in my way. And I really want to thank you guys so much for just 10 years because We've been through so much on this channel, and I'm actually waiting to transform. Murno's really annoying me right now, especially the clones, because I'm trying to target the original, but we have the clones just keep getting in my way. You know what? I think if this continues, yeah, I'm gonna have to, I'm gonna have to transform. I'm gonna have to show these angelic beings the power that a mortal possesses. But first, I want to see how far we can actually go. So on today's video, we have a whole lot of stuff to talk about, a whole lot of things to go through, a whole lot of games as well. And I think, I mean, I'm not sure how many games, but but let me just go on ahead and do something real quick. Watch this. Oh yeah, we're gonna we're gonna step it up. Super Saiyan Blue one, Super Saiyan Blue two, and now Super Saiyan Blue three. Look at his hair growing out, dude. It's insane. And to think that the mod community had done this. There we go. Okay, so we actually possess the power of Ikari as well. And Murno's finished. And I want to thank everybody for enjoying all of the Murno stories that we've done in 2021, 2020. 
the end of 2019. I want to thank everybody for just enjoying all of the stories that we brought you guys because, I mean, I'm, first of all, I'm trying to survive this because I was going to say it's not easy to do and I genuinely appreciate everybody that's been watching and just being here since the beginning for the mods, for the gaming stuff, for the live streams and whatnot. I'm not sure if I could do this for another 10 years, I'll be honest with you guys, but I mean, it's just been a roller coaster. I mean, we've had ups, we've had downs. Myrno has certainly had ups and downs and uh, I want to finish off the clone. I want to fight the... Oh, there goes uh, there goes Broly. Broly's like... Kak -kak -kak -kak. like where, where is he? Is the original... Am I the only one left? I better not be. I swear to God, because there's no reason for Broly and Myrno to be targeting me at the same time. I don't think that's the case, but I think... Oh, oh, hell no. This is not good. Okay, so... All right, well, well the others are actually all intact, so I have no idea what the hell's happening. The original's whooping my ass. We have the clone that's whooping my ass. Broly wants to go in ahead and just get in on the action, so this is actually going to be a... Uh, oh, this is actually hard. I'm trying to, like, really weigh in my options here, but I want to thank you guys so much for just everything, and no, this is not the end. I have so much more planned for you guys, but to be honest with you, man, I'm going to be talking about this a lot throughout the duration of this video. I'm not sure how long I can continue to do what I do at the consistent basis that I do it on, because some of you guys may know I post, you know, a, a daily video per day, right? Like, it is what it is, but sometimes Sometimes I go the extra mile and I post two videos a day, sometimes give or take depending on the situation, three, and oh crap, oh wait a minute, hold on, so Super Boo Jiren Absorbed is going to try to end everything, I'm not trying to have this happen, I'm trying to just endure and survive, right, I, I mean finishing off Myrna would be great, alright, so there goes that, and I don't think, um, this is really, oh damn, that was nice, oh that was really nice, this dude unleashed a nasty Kamehameha that we just so happen to push Myrno inside of, and we can't let this dude pick up the clone. Hell no. We can't let that happen. We just can't, because if he does, then it's going to be an endless cycle of shit that we're going to have to go through. So either way, I have a few ideas that I want to share with you guys in terms of fan animations, fan manga, and for the gaming roulette series as well. So let me see there. Finally. Oh my. Yo, he was tough. Myrno was tough. And if you guys have not checked out the Myrno videos, I do encourage you guys to do so. But with that being said, I have more fights for you guys. I want to go ahead and do at least one more just to see what kind of carnage we have coming up for the next fight ahead. Okay, so I don't think this fight's going to be an issue because we have Mastered Ultra Instinct Beerus, we have Mastered Ultra Instinct Goku Black, and Super Saiyan Blue Gokan, which is Gohan and Goku's Ultimate Fusion, versus Angelic Ultra Instinct Moral. We have Hakaishin Cooler and Full Power Super Saiyan 3 Cumber. Now, here's the deal, right? So, going forward, I think for the remainder of the year and going into next year and etc., let me know if you guys want to see more of these Dragon Ball mods because the mods are really fun. I think that it offers, what the hell was that? It offers, I think, a different kind of dynamic for playing a game that everyone plays, but except you have modded maps, you have modded characters, you have modded settings and stuff like that. So in terms of the mods, you guys want to see more of that, yay or nay. Now in terms of also the fan animations, let me know as to what kind of fan animations you guys want to see in the future. And we'll take some of these like modded fights and we'll make it into an actual animation. I'm going to end everybody. Oh, wow, cooler. Okay, so I guess the only way I could do this is if Beerus starts Hakaiing people, right? And I mean, who would have thought? Because I was such a newbie when I started modding stuff, especially when, you know, hiring people and whatnot. Hakai, it's done. Uh, did we get him? We did not get him. Okay, so I was such a newbie when I first started mo modding things, like back in like 2013. 14, then we had Xenoverse 1, then we had, you know, Xenoverse 2 and stuff like that, which was a total mess, I think, at first. But once I started to, like, kind of learn and, you know, just put things together in a sense where, like, the mods work, it just took off from there. So, Hakai, is it over? Is it over? Can you, like, stop? There we go. I was about to say, can you, like, stop moving? Yeah, Cooler's done. You feel that, Cooler? Yes. All right, so he's done. All right, Cooler is finished. He should be done. I think, yeah, is that Cumber? Yeah, Cumber's done, too. Some of these mods are so busted, man, but some of these games are so fun by using them. Okay, is it over? Can we just get rid of Moro? And, yeah, Gokan actually finished them off. That was... That was a really fast fight. I wasn't expecting for that to happen, but either way, I want to go on ahead and move on to the next game because, like I said before, so many games, so many things to talk about, and with that said, let's go on ahead and not waste any more time. Holy crap, we are back on some Back for Blood. Now, a lot of you guys may know that I just loved Left 4 Dead, right? And I used to play Left 4 Dead a lot on the channel, 
So, what the hell is everyone doing? Can we just leave already? I am so ready to leave. This game gets a lot of shit, you know, from a lot of people that often say, oh, it's just a ripoff of Left 4 Dead. It's like, yo, this game is fire. What are you talking about? Oh, okay, so let me see. I got my machete. I got my machete. Yo, look at these, look at this military dude, bro. You better, oh, someone shot him, bro. What are you doing? Oh, these guys are crazy. Okay, so is everyone ready? Like, what's, what's happening right now? Like, why, why are we shooting each other? Like, you know what I mean? All right, time for us to open. All right, we lost contact with the supply team. Time for us to take down the Zeds, homie. This is kind of creepy. I mean, not for nothing, I would have loved for a zombie apocalypse to actually happen. But then again, it's like, knowing the way society is now, we, 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 we would not have survived. All right, open the chambers. Here we go. Look at this. Ah, oh, here they are. Yo, I will take down every single one of these, man. What, what are they calling this game? The Ridden? Look how stupid they are. Screw them. Yeah, you want some smoke? You want some smoke? Yay! Oh, damn it. Yo, playing this on the PS5 is, like, so cruddy. Because, like, the freaking... The combat system is, like, so meh. All right, um... Where are we gonna go? We have to move through the buildings, right? I'm not trying to get caught by the damn ridden, you feel me? I'm not trying to get eaten by a zombie. Ten years of this, though, guys. Let me know. Let me know if you guys want to see more of the... Oh, I got a sniper. I remember using this sniper before. Really not my, uh, my forte. Alright, cards activated. Um, so which way are we going is the question. I think we're supposed to go this way, right? Oh, this is some creepy shit, man. Ten years of Unreal and gaming, bro. This is this is what I feel like inside, right? My soul is like all all distorted. Yeet! Oh, damn, bro. We cut right through him. Who wants the smoke? I will give it to everybody, bro. Either way, I, I really hope you guys uh, also check out the Gaming Roulette series on the channel. We have some fire stuff. Like, when I say we have some fire stuff, like, we have some fire. You know what I mean? Because these videos are always meant to be long. You feel me? That's the whole point, because we're playing a whole bunch of random-ass games. But this is definitely one of my favorites. All right, so are we, are we going in? I'm going in. I'm going in. I love how we're like, oh, crap. Oh, crap. Oh, crap. Oh, crap. Yeet, 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 yeet. I love how we're like, we're going in very stealthy. Like, you know what I mean? Grabbing some ammo. All right, can we open this? I need a card. Screw the card. Let's go through the window. When in doubt, just go through the window and start shooting everyone and everything, right? Are they behind me? Oh, no. Damn it, they gave me the they gave me the rabies virus, bro. I'm, I, I can feel myself turning. I can feel myself turning. <laughs> Yo, this is dumb, oh, man, bro. See, I, I think definitely what uh what they need to do is make better fucking zombie movies, right? How many of you guys? Oh, what happened? Break me out of here. Oh, it's my ex. My ex just jumped on my beef like she normally does. Normal. I was gonna say normally enough they make like oh crap. See, that's my ex right there. You blood-sucking bitch. Oh, my God. Look at the size of that thing, dude. Oh, crap. Oh, here come the horde. Here come the... I'm, I'm ready, though. I'm ready for war. I'm ready. Oh, get, oh get, get one of the special infected. Get one of the special infected. Thank you very much. Oh, crap. Wait, I alerted the snitch. That's not good. That's not good. That's not good. Oh, crap. Uh, are they coming from behind us? What, why are... Oh, crap. They're coming through the window. They're coming from the other side. Oh, I just got jizzed on, bro. This is not what I was expecting. Oh, they busted the door down. Oh, we gotta get the hell out of here. Oh, we gotta get the hell out of Dodge, bro. Ten years of Unreal and gaming, bro. And we're just like, we're shooting zombies ten years later, man. We're shooting zombies ten years later. Just like we were shooting zombies ten years ago. You feel me? Right, let me grab some ammo. Uh, what do we have here? I, I just, I could have swore I just saw a shotgun. Where am I bugging out? Oh, this is some creepy shit, man. I hear like one of the big dudes. Where's he at? Where's he at? I hear one of the big freaking zombies. Oh, whoa. Oh, I knew it. I knew I wasn't crazy. Oh, I knew I wasn't crazy. Ah, oh, damn it. I'm covered in guts. This isn't good. Listen, spare me, all right? Spare me. I'm just an innocent man just trying to get from point A to point B. I'm not trying to start any beef. You know what I'm saying? These, uh, these, these infected, though, like, they're pretty, they're pretty solid. Uh, what's happening right now? Oh, perfect. All right, wait. Is this barbed wire? Safe room. Oh, wait, the safe house. Yeah. Oh, perfect. We actually got there. We actually got into the, uh, the safe house in, in one piece. Hurry up before I close the damn door. Hurry up! It's too dark. Hurry up! What are they doing? What, what are y'all doing? Do y'all not want to, like, get into the safe house? Hello? Come on, get into the safe house. Come on. Ah, uh, listen, this is me. This is me in IRL. I will lock that door. I will lock that door. I will take a fat shit right here, bro. I don't even care. What is going on here, man? I hope you guys are watching all the way through, because I'm telling you right now, this is quality stuff. What are they doing? What are y'all doing? 
are these dudes like investigating y'all looking for like We're not gonna be so lucky what are y'all looking for like playboy magazines or something we gotta get the hell out of here i'm telling y'all right now man we have to we have to go into the safe house come on let go let go where, where are they doing dude fuck the supplies oh my god you see when you play with randy's bro it, it just gets tedious you feel me because you're playing with a bunch of randos and they're all like hey man let's go look for like you know davy jones locker and shit and it's like no we have to get into the safe house dude like i'm a white dude man but i'm not i'm not, i don't operate like one these people are all like white people that act like them you know what i mean they operate like white people get inside the freaking house oh this isn't good man what are they trying to do the real r kelly come on man Oh, what are they doing? What are y'all doing, bro? Are y'all, like, trying to start war with the zombies, man? Like, this is not what we wanted. All right, you know what? I'll play ball. I'll play ball. I'll, I'll, I'll search. I'll search around. I'll look around to see what we got going on. Like I was saying before, man, they need some good zombie movies because some of these zombie movies, they have so much potential, but then they just ultimately end up being, like, crap. Like, you know what I mean? Like, it's just so underwhelming. I'm not sure if it's, like, the studios that, oh, man, they were, they were probably getting busy and... Damn, she got she freaking got her whole guts blown out, bro. Damn. My man's meat was so big, he blew out her guts. I was gonna say, man, some of these zombie movies, it's just, I don't know. Like it, it like it has like a good tone, or some of them have like good tones to them, but then after that it just becomes like meh. Like, you know what I mean? Alright, can we go into the safe room? Thank you very much. Come on, guys. Come on. Inside the safe room. That's right. That's right. Come on. Come on. I'm gonna lock your bitch ass out. I'm gonna lock your bitch ass out. Ah, psych! Come on, get in. All right, there we go. Finally, yo. I was about to say, what the hell is taking so long? You feel me? Completed. Listen, it shouldn't have taken that long to get inside the safe room. Like, I get what these dudes were trying to do. Like, you feel me? 44. 44 ridden killed. Uh, I was about to say, wait a minute. That dude killed 9,000 already? Like, what the hell? All right. Let's go in ahead and get... I'm, I'm ready. I'm ready for the next one. So the orphan left. All right, the orphan left. I'm ready for more. Supply points earned. All right, so we're progressing through. All right, perfect. This game is so fun. It's just like, it could be a little tedious sometimes. I mean, depending on who you play with, right? The diner. Listen, there are so many diners in New York that are trash. I can't wait one day, man. Once I rack up some YouTube bread and just get myself a big ass house. Oh, man. I want to move to somewhere where they actually have like good diners. You know what I mean? Uh, I'm adding the stamina card here. All right, so we're good. I think we're good, boogers. All right, I'm ready. Are you guys ready? You guys ready? Come on, grab this. Uh, actually, I, I don't need that. So how do I get rid of that? All right, whatever. Uh, who else is? Who else is dipping? Let's go. Who else is? Who else is leaving? I'm telling y'all right now, this game is so much fun. Like it, again, it just reminds me so much of Left 4 Dead. And we did, and we played so much of Left 4 Dead. You know, on the channel mods and all you guys can go back and look like 10 years ago man like some of those mods were just so bad all right uh can we just dip can we dip can we dip all right perfect let's get the hell out of here let's make a move before I change all right who wants the smoke y'all want the smoke i'll give everybody the smoke you feel me everybody gets the smoke Need to reload. all right look at these zombies y'all think i'm stupid y'all think y'all look at that you, you thought you thought i wasn't gonna think that you were alive machete Come on, come on. I got that UI skill. I'm taking off legs. You feel me? I am taking legs off. All right. Uh, what is this? Oh. Oh, right in the face. Come on. Get rid of her. Get rid of her. Get rid of the snitch. There we go. Oh, wait. Is the horde coming? Oh, that's not good. Oh, that's not good. Here come the horde. And they're all jumping over this stupid ass wall. Like, they're, they're not going to get far. You know what, though, guys? I am a little curious as to all of the games that we're going to be playing on this video. Which, again, I mean, remember, all the timestamps are located down below if you guys want to just watch something specific. You feel me? We got Dragon Ball content. We got... Oh, oh, we got... We got my ex. She's back. You bitch. Leave me alone. Oh, crap. Oh, crap. Oh, what happened? I got pushed back for a second. All right. Uh, let's, let's progress. Let's continue to progress. Let's continue to push forward. All right. What's going on here? Oh, crap. Here they come. You know, this reminds me of, like, 28 Days Later slash, like, I Am Legend zombies. Like, you know what I mean? Looks like that's not budging without help. All right, are we... Where are we going? Are we going straight? Oh, what the hell was that? Shit. What the hell was that? Wait, what the hell's going on? Oh, what the... Oh, what is happening right now? Oh, this is not good. Oh, this is not good. Yo, can we just take him out? Yeah, thank you. Take him out. Oh, what is happening? Oh, what is happening? They're all over the place, dude. 
Oh, I see what we're doing. Oh, yeah, I forgot about this. Oh, crap. Come on, come on, come on. I'm just shooting all over the place, bro. Machete time! Yo, I'll slash and dash all of you. Stop playing with me. Let go of my friend. Knife, knife, knife. All right, the diner is this way. <clears throat> all right, so where are we going? Where are we going? Open the door. Uh, are we supposed to open it? I forgot, man. Yeah, are we supposed to go through here? All right. Oh, damn, he went down. Sorry, bro. I'm trying to get to that diner. You feel me? I'm trying to get to that diner. I'm, I'm slashing and hacking zombies like nothing. Oh, crap. Oh, crap. Maybe, maybe, maybe I shouldn't have gone this way by myself. But I got big... Oh, I was about to say, no, dude. Let me go, let me go, let me go. Yeet! You think you tough? All right, hold on, hold on, hold on. Let's get rid of him. Hold on. Oh, they're stabbing me, bro. They're... they're oh, no, no, no. Crap, crap, crap. Get away from me, get away from me. Get rid of him, get rid of... Oh, damn it! Damn it, merge the Masu! Oh, he's... Yo, he's... He's putting it to me, dude. Help! Help! Oh, damn it. Yeah, we gotta get the hell out of here, man. We gotta get the fuck out of here. All right, there's the diner. All right, great. Oh, we got a chainsaw. That's right. Was that a chainsaw? Oh, that's a minigun. Oh, yeah. Who wants the smoke? I will give it to everybody, homie. Look at this freaking diner. I mean, this diner is pretty souped up. I like that. Uh, let's. Oh, hell yeah. Hell yeah. We got ammo. We got grenades, bro. I'm grabbing everything. I'm grabbing everything. I got yours. All right. What's the... Uh, Oh, get the generator, that's right. Supplies. But be prepared when you do, because okay. every ridden in the vicinity is going to come running. Oh, crap. Every, every single ridden? All right, so that means... Oh, no, that's my minigun. What are you doing? What are you... What is he... I'm about to stab this guy in the head. What is he doing? That's my freaking minigun. Oh! By the way, also, I want to know, like, what some of your favorite videos are from me on the channel. Whether that be like Dragon Ball videos, gaming roulette videos, whatever the case may be. Are you guys going to power the generator or what? Because I'm ready for war. Thank I'm you. ready to smack some mother effing ridden around here. You know what I'm saying? All right. Are they going to do it or what? Come on. Come on, you guys. Come on. Power the generator. Power the generator. Come on. Ten years of this. I mean, I can only imagine what's going to happen like in the next ten years of like... Just introducing all kinds of games like this. Like, you know what I mean? All oh, we're all oh, we're putting a uh, barbed wire. Yes. Yes. All right, what is this? Um I right, repair the generator. I guess I have to do that since nobody else is going to do it, right? Alright, perfect. Here we go, folks. I'm ready for war. Who wants it? I'll oh crap. Yee! Oh, I'm 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 missing everything. I should have turned this turret around. Oh, that's not good. Okay, okay, uh, I'm gonna use this. Get out of the f get out of the way! Get out of the way, lady! Oh, this sucks, man. I aimed the turret in the wrong direction. Crap, get out of the freaking way! I will I will gun through everybody. I will gun through everybody, bro. Stop playing with me. Stop playing with me! Oh, here they come, here they come, here they come. Yo, everyone's getting the smoke. I am a friendly fire type of person, yo. You get in my way, and everyone's gonna eat the lead. Everyone's gonna eat the lead, homie. Everyone's gonna eat the lead, homie. All right, I'm gonna have to... Oh, crap. All right, let me get rid of him. By the way, if you guys want me to, like, play more of the, uh... You know, the inclusion of Back for Blood, then let me know. Because if you guys want to see more Back for Blood content, let me know. I'm always down to do it. I, I, I love this game a lot. Oh, they're jumping over the... Yo, they're jumping over the generator, bro. Oh, this isn't good. Who's smacking me? Oh, damn. Come on, come on. Get rid of... Oh, get rid of the special infected. That's right, that's right. Come on, put in some work. Put in some work. Oh, crap. Put in some work. Listen, we would have been infected. We would have been infected a long time ago because these zombies were spitting on us. They were freaking drooling on us. Like, you know what I mean? Damn it. I need ammo. I need ammo. Give me ammo. Okay, cool. Where they at? Where they at? Oh, there they come. Here's more. Here's more. Here's daddy. Actually, yeah, let me, let me. Empanada's inbound. Yeet. Oh, that was, that was good. Crap, 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 crap. Are they, oh, they're jumping over. They're jumping over. That's not good. Damn. Okay. Um, my team's, my team's holding off pretty well. The barbed wire could, could definitely do some work. Like, it could definitely get some work here, but. Aw, oh, damn it, damn it, damn it. Come on. And to think that we've entered a random ass game just to be involved in this. Oh, take him out, take him out. Come on, boys. Come on, boys. Oh, there's people behind me. Oh, 
Where are they at? Where are they at? Come on, take him down, take him down. Is there somebody on the... Oh, they're on the roof. How the hell did he get on the roof? Yo, how the hell did he get on the roof? I, I want to get on the roof. I don't want to be down here with these guys. We got two minutes left, man. Grab some more ammo. All right, I am ready. Y'all want the smoke? We all get the smoke. Y'all all gonna get the smoke. All right, empanadas inbound. Oh, that was beautiful. Did we get anybody? Probably not. Damn, damn. Oh, we're out of ammo. Oh, no, no, no. We're out of ammo. Oh, shit. We're out of ammo. Oh, shit, baskets. All I, oh, crap. Let go of me. Help. Oh, crap. Oh, crap. All I have is a machete, bro. All I have is a machete, and I will try, I will try to do my best. Oh, come on. All right, first aid kit used. We need a little bit of help here. They're coming through, and I can only use my machete for so long, bro. That's like, that's like, uh... That's like, you know, somebody trying to destroy zombies by using a chopstick. Like, come on. All right. Oh, my God. We need to get inside. We need to get inside. I have no ammo. I, I, I mean, all I have... I mean, I, I, I need a rifle. Fuck it. Chop and block. That's right. Come on. Come on. That's right. Machete time, homie. I'm slicing and dicing. I will slice through every... Oh, never mind. I have made a mistake. I have made a mistake by engaging with these things, man. I should have been infected. I should have. My ass should have been infected, man. Oh, come on, come on. I'm, I'm chopping real slow because because the infection is coursing through my blood. I can feel the rabies. Oh, brother. This is like this is like me trying to fight off <laughs> the, the virus of unknown origin from like 2020. Oh, this is not good, man. They're coming in. I can't, I can't even swing. My character can't even swing, like, heavy. Because, like, I'm out of stamina. I'm out of everything, man. I have no ammo. We got 41, 40, 39, 38, 37 seconds left. Oh, crap. Big guy. Oh, big guy coming. Come on, come on. All right, you want smoke? Oh, there we go. Took him out. Perfect. Come on. I got my stamina back. Less than 30 seconds, boys. Less than 30 seconds. Let's go. Let's go. What is this? What is this? Oh, is that ammo? Yes. Yes, I have ammo. Thank God. Thank Jesus. Repent, sinners. Yo, we have to hurry up. We have to hurry up and get inside of that freaking safe house, man. Come on. Take him out. Take him out. Take him out. I am shooting all over the fucking place. Three, two. All right. Are we good? Are we good? What's going on? Damn it. They're everywhere. All right. Now what? Now what? Now what? Now what? I forgot. Do we go in? Oh, we did it. Good job, people. Safe. Oh, that was great. That was solid. That was great. Meet you back here after you freshen up. Oh, we survived, man. We survived at the diner. That was great. Perfect. Perfect ending, man. Okay, now come on now. This is a classic Dragon Ball Z Budokai 3, and right now, I want to go on ahead and showcase Broly versus Kid Buu. And the reason why I wanted to go back to this, and listen, booting up my Xbox 360 was not an easy thing to do. Look at Buu, and look at Broly. Man, these games are like so far removed. I mean, especially for, you know, all the games that we have nowadays, all the graphical updates and all that kind of stuff. So let me go on ahead and beat down Broly. And I remember, and I don't know, I'm not sure if you guys also remember this, but when we did Let's Plays and Walkthroughs in the channel featuring, you know, all the Budokai games, Raging Blast, etc. This is, um, I forgot how to play, man. This is not, oh, he burned himself out. Perfect. Vanishing Ball. That's all we're gonna do. Vanishing Ball galore. We're gonna, we're gonna, we're gonna suffocate Broly with a bunch of Vanishing Balls. Now, here's the thing, right? So, I was saying to myself, I don't really want to go back and, like, redo some of the Let's Plays and Walkthroughs. Oh, this is gonna be dope. I remember this. This system used to be so cool, especially back in the day when we used to be, like, really competitive as kids. I know I used to be. And playing this on the PS2, but way back in the day was just nuts. Hosting tournaments and stuff like that. Let me see if I can actually pull this victory off. Can I get one more? That's all I need is one more. Perfect. All right, so we win. Now, I remember I was saying to myself, I don't really want to go back and do, like, walkthroughs and let's plays on these games because I've already done them, but occasionally, I guess I'll just go back 
to see if I can go back and just relive all of the epicness that was of the Budokai games because the Budokai games were so good and they still are I mean they still hold a lot of weight so let me see if I can knock all oh, this is oh crap I have to crap I have to spin my analog stick I remember back in the day man this was so intense I, I used to get calluses on my freaking fingers playing this I mean in the comment section below oh crap let me know because believe it or not there are a lot of people that would say oh yeah Koyama's Broly would stomp out any version of Boo as a matter of fact there have been so many debates that I've seen throughout the years specifically I would say in the last two years where people defend Koyama's Broly to say that Broly from the original Dragon Ball Z movies would slap everybody and I was saying to myself like what because I remember Koyama put out this statement to say that Broly was the strongest ever right so I remember people ran with that saying oh yeah Broly stomps Super Saiyan 3 Goku Broly stomps Kid Buu Broly stomps everybody and it's like what but right now that's exactly what I'm trying to do and stomp this guy out because if I don't and I end up losing to him then that's not going to be a good look for me you know what I mean especially by using Kid Buu one of my favorite boos like you just the, the most insane boo out of them all and I'm trying to put this guy down and it's not working something's got to give right and I just never would have thought I would be here like 10 years later still reliving this and Broly's done let me ah oh, damn it all right let me see I, I need to put him down I mean so far we're ahead by a lot uh, I want to knock him out of the map I don't think I can but vanishing ball okay he countered me again I have to put him down dude he keeps countering me stop counter oh he's done yeah that was a good one as a matter of fact we're not done that was a good one but we have more because we're not gonna let this game go without going out in the bang right I mean right Vegeta versus Goku a classic I mean we've seen this time and time again but why not just see it one more time on Budokai right Budokai 3 one of the best games I would say ever so let me see how well I can do look at Vegeta man I mean just looking back on the models and we got end of Z Goku or GT Goku in that case I'm using Vegeta just in case some of you guys are gonna be like oh crap he's gonna use Goku and then go Super Saiyan 3 nah I mean I'm for, for this I, I've seen mods for this game too where Vegeta goes Super Saiyan 3 etc etc right but I, I know the controls are so wonky and if Goku ends up beating me that's not gonna be good but I, I guarantee you this is gonna be a really good fight so if you guys remember some of the older videos I have on my channel then let me know which one of them were your favorites and also I really want to know like how long you guys have been on this channel because I practically grew up with so many of you guys I I don't really recognize too many comments per se but I do recognize like usernames right when people comment and if I'm familiar with your name I would immediately know you off the gate and I've seen so many people come back throughout the years and it really means a lot to me because it's like you guys kind of grew up with me you know what I mean like we all grew up together like think about it 10 years right like where the hell were you 10 years ago versus now like you know what I mean like we all we all came up together in this community in this fandom and you guys made this fandom so much more special for me so let me see if I could take down Goku by using the form that I have because obviously we don't have the Hakai Shin ultra ego form we don't have UI and stuff like this was such a, a simple time you feel me but a more aggressive time because I remember we used to yo Goku's yo that's right breaking his guard that's right it's over yo listen if I if I lose to Goku that's not going to be good right now because I'm using Vegeta and everybody knows that if Vegeta loses then everyone's just gonna go back shit crazy Ooh, oh that was yo, that was so sick I love that I love that I miss that for some of these games you know what I mean but also let me know some of your favorite characters that you guys have been using or used in the Budokai games way back in the day why would I yo he just jumped over that was that was the he did it twice he did it twice oh I oh okay I, I was about to say I went head first into that one. Oh crap all right come on Come on, Vegeta. I have to beat him. I have to beat him. I just have to. I know I didn't just boot up my 360, right? To go back to this, only for me to get fodderized. Nah, that's not gonna happen, Chief. Uh, unless, of course, I somehow... He keeps blasting me, dude. Unless, of course, I somehow break the game's engine and I just transform into, like, Super Saiyan God or Super Saiyan Blue, you know what I mean? That'd be crazy, but... I mean, the modders, like I said before, the modders for all of these games, they make it that much more enjoyable, that much more fun, because imagine just using mods for a lot of these games. It's awesome. Like, I don't see why or how anyone can have an issue by using mods for these games. Only on PC, though, not on, on console, obviously. But 10 years, man. I mean, who knows what's going to happen in the next 10 years? I mean, for I mean, for all we know, who knows if I'm still going to be here, you know what I mean? God forbid, right? I freaking croak or something along the way before, like, another 
big time Dragon Ball game drops, like, you know what I mean? But hopefully that's not the case, and I want to thank you all so much for just being here since day one, man. The fan mangas, the fan animations, the games. Oh, crap, man. All right, Goku. He's using Kaioken, so the dude has mastered Kaioken to the T. All right, I, I, need to, I need to defend myself. I wonder how I'm going to beat him if I can. And if I lose, I mean, I lost to Goku out of all people. Oh, here we go. Exchange. And I'm fighting Kaioken and base. My boy base Vegeta's throwing hands. Throwing hands. This is going to be a close fight, though. This is going to be a close fight. Oh, this is bad. This is going to be a close fight. Holy crap, my hands are getting really sweaty. And like, have you guys ever engaged in a, in, a, in a game and you just get nervous? You're like, oh, crap, this is close. You know what I mean? Look at this. He's using Kaioken. He's upping up his freaking strength. Oh, yeah, he's done. He's done. Come on, Vegeta. One more. One more. Gallic gun. Is it over? Yep. Oh, yeah. That, that, that's all she wrote. Vegeta wins. Hands down. Watch this. Oh, this was great. This was great to go back on. Perfect. Okay, so with that being said, now let's go on ahead and jump into the next game to see what we got coming up next. Okay, so this is going to be a first. Welcome to Summer of 58. I am, I guess, some kind of a paranormal investigator, and I am in Russia. I don't know, I don't know why, right? This is like a creepy ass, this is a creepy ass place, man. Okay, so I guess, I guess what I have to do here, why are all these doors and everything like barricaded? So my mission is to find out what the heck is going on, which I have no idea what's going on. Oh, this is creepy, man. Listen, this is like white people stuff. I'm white, but I would never do like some white people shit like this. You know what I mean? Looking for ghosts. Oh, oh what the hell was that? Did someone feed the cats here? Who cares about the fucking cats, dude? Like, what am I supposed to do? Eat cat food? I mean, I mean, just judging based on how I have got here, right? Like, everything's, like, all barricaded and stuff. Okay, uh, this is... This is bad. All right, so this guy doesn't apparently believe... Oh, look at those gas masks. Okay, so someone's obviously here, right? Someone obviously has to be here. Because we don't just have, like, gas masks for nothing, right? So, I guess this guy doesn't believe, like, in the paranormal. So, I, I'm, I'm just trying to, like... I guess find the paranormal, you know, just by being here. But I, I mean, but I, I don't, I don't have a camera. I don't have a gun. Can I take these? Oh wait, oh I can. Okay, great. All right, let's just take these down. Let's look for some ghosts, yeah. The paranormal. Here we go. Let's just take this down. All right. Uh, what's in this bathroom? Oh, look at this place. I can't even read that. What, what does this say? It's all in Russian. So. Like, were dudes eating in the bathroom? What is all this? What the hell is this? Oh, we have a lighter. We're gonna be smoking some marijuana in the bathroom, huh? Oh, what the hell? Well, that's not good. Okay, so birds are birds are chirping and flapping out there. I don't know why. I mean, I, I, I need to figure out why I'm in this bathroom. I mean, who knows? Maybe my character has to take a shit. Is there anything in, the, in these toilets, I suppose? Nothing? This is, like, really bad. I mean, this is, like... Chernobyl stuff you like you know what I mean listen guys you could never pay me enough what the hell was that oh I don't like this man I really don't like the vibes right now can I remove these I can't uh, okay can I remove these okay I can't you can't pay me enough to be at a place like this I'm sorry by myself are you insane there's like these toy trucks and stuff like nah 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 homie you can't pay me enough to be at a place like this the, i mean there's gas masks here so I, I i want one i would bust through these windows so quick i would not even be here i'm sorry oh what the hell was that okay so i mean outside of the the newspaper article i could have swear i heard something i mean i have my headphones in what am i supposed to do like i, I I'm guessing things are supposed to happen. That's what the game was listed as. Things happen and you're supposed to kind of like dive deeper into uncovering what's happening, right? Which, I mean, at this point, we're just like walking around. I, I guess, what the hell was that? Oh, wait a minute. Is there someone behind this door? Oh, nah, dude. Hold on, let me... I'm just trying to see if I can open that. All right, well, there's a phone here. I guess I can't use it to call anybody. I can't read what it says. All right. Um, what is this? That's a fuse box. Okay. The fuse is blown. There is no light in the building. Well, of course not. We're in like this abandoned. I don't even know what the hell this is like daycare center or whatever. Listen, man, when there's kids involved like that, that's a no go for me. Freaking ghost children and shit. 
like i want to say this is like a school or whatever but i know this is about to intensify real quick <laughs> like you know what i mean i'm just trying to see like what what is what is the goal here are these messages or something i mean those are obviously just carved into the freaking wall for a reason <laughs> this is not like I, I don't know these windows are kind of open though so did someone come in did someone get out you know all right there has to be something here there's got to be some clues there has to be oh what the hell Oh no, things are really starting to get intense. Like I'm starting to hear stuff. I'm not sure if you guys are hearing things or not, but I'm just looking around. I'm trying to see what I can find. There has to be something. There has to be a clue, a gun, but just being the fact that, where does this run to? Okay, so that's, that's the radiator. There's gotta be something because as this game progresses, things get more intense, right? So I'm, I'm assuming there's a, uh, I, mean, I, I would so bust that open and just crawl. So I'm assuming as this continues, you know, things, things are really going to intensify. But I'm just trying to see, like, what's around because we found a lighter. I'm not sure what the lighter is for. Is there, there has to be something around here. Yo, just the sheer fact, the way we're walking around, this is, like, creepy. All right, well, there's got to be at least one clue around here. What is this? So, I mean, obviously, look at that. They were smoking in here. So, people are... What the hell is that? Yo, what the hell is this? Oh, hell no, dude. That wasn't there before, or am I just bugging out? Oh, nah, bro. In the 10 years I've been doing this, I've played games like this before, but this is like... Hold on, what is... Is that a letter? Can I crouch? Oh, I can crouch. Perfect. What is this? I can't read what it says. Damn it. Yo, that little jackrabbit thingy. Like, what the hell was that? It has, like, needles in its eyes. Like... What is this? Oh, yo, you, you can feel the atmosphere getting tense. Okay, let me... Let me get the hell out of here. That wasn't there before. I know that wasn't there before. let me see if i can there's got to be something going what the hell was that i know you guys can hear that right okay you can tell like do you guys feel that like like it's getting tense Something is here somewhere, right? It has to be. Oh! What the fuck? Not what? What? Where would that come from? Hold on. Fucking cats, bro. Okay, the window. Uh, did it come from here? Oh crap! That thing is gone. Look. That thing is gone. That little evil rabbit thing is gone. Oh wait, what the hell is that noise? Yo, y'all hear that? That's a siren. Alright, uh, it's gonna get dark soon. Need to look for candles. Yo, y'all... Oh, oh, look at that thing. Wait, hold on, hold on. We found candles. Hold on. That little, that little rabbit thing is right there now. Y'all see that? Look at it. It's right there. What the hell? Oh, nah, bro. Why is there a siren going off? What's about to happen? Oh, I don't want to be here. Give me the gas mask. Oh, no. Nah, this is too much, man. Yeah, this is... You could tell the birds are, like, all, like, flying around. All right. I need to light the candles now. All right. Uh, light this one. Light that one. And light that one. Okay, now what? What am I supposed to do? Uh, now I can spread out my sleeping bag. We're staying here for the night? What are you, stupid? Oh, hell no. I mean, it's best to leave now. Now nah, you're bugging out, bro. I would not. Uh, okay, where's my sleeping bag? I'm trying to figure this out. Where's my... Do I not have, like, an inventory system? Like, what am I supposed to do here? This is not good. Why Why does this guy want to stay here? Oh, no, no. I, I blew that one out by accident. No, no, no. Why are we staying here? Like, this, this, is, this is not... 
Is my sleeping bag like over here somewhere? Is this it? What the hell is that noise? Yo, it's getting tense. You could feel it. Is this it? I think this is it. All right, there's my sleeping bag. All right, perfect. Damn, now I need to prepare for the night. How about no, right? How many of you guys would actually do this? Nah, I'm not doing that. Summer of 58, 1958. We got no phones, barely have flashlights, night one. Oh, this is like some paranormal activity shit. Oh, man. Okay, well, here we are. All right, night one. Oh, hell no. Oh, shit. All right. Ten years of this? Man, this is some creepy stuff, man. Um, all right, do I have a... Let me grab that. Oh, crap, dude. Let me, let me grab this camera. What the hell was that? Hold on, hold on, hold on. Okay. Whoa. What was that? Oh, nah, bro. Nah, see, that we're it's, it's nighttime. Things are getting crazy. I'm not trying to be here. All right, so that's how you zoom in and out. All right, um... Listen, this dude's here to find Babushka. I am not here to speak to Babushka, bro. Oh, nah, man. Can we not? See, I want... I need that gas mask, man. I don't trust this place. Look at this. Okay, uh... Any ghosts around here? Any demons? I'm not the one, man. Trust me. I probably don't even taste good. Yo, like, things are beginning to, like, really intensify. Like, you can start hearing things, like, around. I encourage you guys to listen to this with your headphones on. That's the only way you'll be able to kind of understand. Oh, nah, bro. Is there somebody watching me from the vents? There's something in this room. You can feel it. Like, I can hear that shit in my freaking headphones. I need that fuse. Like, right? I, I That's what I'm guessing I need. I need to put, like, a little fuse thingy in there, right? The phone don't work. There's no, like, fire extinguisher, so... Freaking trap here, man. What is this? Why would he even want to be here? Like, that doesn't make no sense. What is this? Aw, oh, damn it. I can't even read what it says. That's whack. It's, it's, it's pitch dark outside. Why would he even be here? Alright, I'm just looking for clues. There, I mean, there's a first aid kit here. What is this? What is this? What is this? Oh, it's a picture of a bunch of women. Okay. Uh, 1946. So, uh, what is this? Like a coven? Are there witches up in here? Oh, nah, dude. Are there witches up in here? Something's going on, man. I don't even... What the hell is this? Oh, that's a picture. Whoa. It's Babushka. It's my grandma. There's there's not, well, there's not. a little bit of blood on it, though. That's weird. That wasn't there before. So somebody put that picture there. Like, that wasn't even there. Oh, that's... Cre yeah, it's creepy. This is creepy shit. So someone put that picture there from the outside. There's a beer here. I gotta get out of here, man. I'm not trying to be here. I'm probably going to play this game more often, like, you know, as the months roll on by, if you guys want me to. I got to get out of here. What the hell was that? Oh, someone just knocked on the door. Which door, though? Was it this one? Look at that. Yo, that rabbit's there again, dude. That rabbit mouse thing. Yo, I gotta climb out through these windows or something, bro. I can't be here. This this is a bad omen. I'm getting chills right now. This is a bad omen, man. Just chill. Stop playing with me. Which door did they knock from? I'm, I gotta get out of here, man. I'm hearing things, dude. When in doubt, just get the fuck out. Trust, that's, that's my mantra. Trust me. I gotta get out of here. There has to be a way. I'm also curious on, like, what time it is, right? Is it, like, midnight? 2 a.m.? 
Whoa. Oh, hell no. I'm hearing things from upstairs now. So now there's running coming from upstairs. Shit, dude. Is there a cat in here or a rat? Oh, man. Can we not? What the hell is that noise, bro? Oh, my God. That thing is right there now. This is... Yo, there was, there was tapping by the window. Yeah, something's outside. Nope, 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 nope. Some. Yo, something's outside. Look at this thing. I gotta get out of here, man. I really gotta get the hell out of here. Oh, the door is locked. I mean, what? What the? Yo, what's going on? Yo, oh, chill, chill, chill. It is locked. Wow. Wait a minute. So I'm locked in here with something, right? I'm going to shit my pants. Oh, what do I do, man? Oh, that thing is gone. Oh, boy. Yep. This is my demise. What is even happening, bro? I'm playing this for my 10-year Annie for the channel? What the hell, dude? Okay, I need a... I need to grab a mask or something. I need, I need to figure something out. This is not... This is not what's going to help me. Can I open this door? Uh, why can't I open the door, though? So, I, I'm guessing something locked me from the other side, right? So, I guess I have to escape via finding something out here, right? I can't go through this door, and I can't really go through that. Oh! What the... What, what's going on? The phone is ringing. All right, I need to answer that phone. As what the hell? No, nope. bruh. Who are you? Uh, all right, let me go. Let me. Whoa. What just happened? Oh. Oh hell no. Nope. Nope. We were gonna go answer the phone, and there was a child there. Like that's not even a kid. That's a demon. Oh nah. Oh nah. What? Oh, I can't wait to go back to this game. Oh, you're going to be seeing it real soon. What the hell was that? Okay, so need I say more? Dragon Ball Fighters, we have the team of Beerus, Super Saiyan God, Gogeta, and now we have Kaioken Mastered Ultra Instant Goku. Look at the overall design. You guys know how much I love this, but also, you know how much I love this guy. Look at this dude, Mastered Ultra Instant Goku Black. He looks absolutely phenomenal, and what's crazy about this is, if you were to tell me, I don't know, maybe like 8 years ago, 10 years ago, that we were gonna get a Dragon Ball game like this, this has to be, without question, one of the prettiest Dragon Ball games ever, like just hands down. Even compared to Kakarot, it's such a beautiful game, and let me see if I can go on ahead and whoop Goku Black here on the 10 year Annie, we have to, we have to, and I don't know, who knows, maybe 10 years from now, I'm gonna look back, I'm gonna be like in my 40s, 50s, 60s, whatever, whatever time loop we end up going through, because who, who would have thought we would have gone through all the stuff that we did in 2020 and 2021 and stuff like that, so Black is down, he's out of the picture, and now we got Omni Zamasu, you guys know Omni Zamasu had to make a return, uh, we, we often used Omni Zamasu no matter what, because the concept of him having to take the Omni King's power and body is just incredible to me so let me go on ahead and whoop some ass we have janemba on the there he is oh boy, listen the last thing i want here is for janemba to get the better of me but i don't know maybe maybe i'm about to whoop all these guys just by simply using the adaptation of kaioken mastered ui goku so that kamehameha would have just blown every cell out of this dude's body like that's it it would have been done game over he wouldn't have survived this but janemba's getting kind of lucky on me He's getting kind of lucky. And you know what's also crazy? Way back in the day, I probably would have made like a, a what if conversation having, you know, a discussion about what if Omni Zamasu fought, you know, Master UI, Kaioken, Goku, like stuff like that. That's what I used to do way back in the day, man. So just to celebrate, we're just going to have some fun. We often do fighters as an opener, um, but more or less, I'm not sure where I'm placing fighters for this video, but I'm ending this portion of this fight with Kaioken Mastered Ultra Instant Goku. I mean, just look at this. It's over. The, the entire team just fell, and I didn't have to use anybody else outside of MUI Kaioken Goku. That's all she wrote. So 
this fight's finished, I really feel bad for my allies because I definitely want to use them. So let's go on ahead and jump into the next fight to see what we got coming up ahead. So I was on record before saying that Hit is probably my favorite character in Fighters, so why not go on ahead and introduce him as the team leader to go up against the one, the only, look at that, the modded version of Broly, full-powered Super Saiyan Broly. I want to see, I want to see if we can get the better of this other team because I know normally enough Hit sometimes doesn't really work in my favor, so hopefully enough my controller isn't going to break down on me but fighters is one of those games man where you can still play it till this day and it's super super fun the only thing is i really really wish that this game had more customizable options right because the only thing you can really do is just customize their outfits online and that's about it right so let me see broly is whooping me yo i'm telling you sometimes with hit i just have bad luck but i mean more often than not i feel like hit really works in my opinion some people may not main as him but for me if i were to play fighters online that's my main. So Broly goes down. Enter Golden Cooler. Let's do I mean, he looks fantastic, dude. Uh, not today. Not against the Assassin, you don't cooler. Not against the Assassin. He got Baby on his squad. Here we go. Time skip. Listen, Toki Tobash. This is so cool, man. I mean, listen. I don't know what the, the, the future may lie in terms of Dragon Ball, like going forward five, ten years from now. I can only hope for more polished games like this. Yo, I, you have to love that. Yo, Wadi Dug just knocking Cooler back. I, I, you can only hope to see games that look this good, right? Because this is, without without a doubt, one of the best-looking games ever, in my opinion, for Dragon Ball, right? So, Baby versus, uh, Baby versus Jiren, not today. You trying to infect me? Is that what you're trying to do? You're trying to gain access to the strongest mortal? Not today. My hands are getting a little sweaty, though, because, uh, I haven't really played you know, intensely like this for, for this game in, in quite some time. But now we got Boo. This would be, yo, this would be such a good fight because you would have the Parasite trying to invade the Majin's body and take control. But then again, I, I doubt that even Baby would be able to do that, in my opinion. But then again, I, I think I think as though if, if Boo were to eat him or do something of the sorts, it would work a lot better than Baby trying to get inside of his body to control him. So let me see if I can get the better of him. I'm trying to, there we go. Can I use this? Is it gonna work? Please let it work. Okay, so barely. That did nothing. Am I really about to go down? I really hope not. I hope that Kid Boo, let me see, there we go. I was about to say, I really do hope that Kid Boo can get the better of him, but if I can't, then, I mean, so be it. So now, the final person, the final opposition is Cooler. I really want to see if I can finish him off by using my ultimate. Well, not in this case. All right, so Cooler, Cooler got the one up on Kid Boo. Not against Jiren, he won't. I, I, I can promise you that one. I want to see, because every single time I try to do the rotation, it just never works in my favor. So, I don't know. I, I don't want to beat him so casually, because it looks as though I'm, I'm about to win. So, let me see. Oh, he's really... Yo, Cooler is really trying to hammer down on me, dude. The 10-year Annie, I really can't believe it. I, I just can't. I just can't. And I'm using some of the older mods, because these mods are still fire, in my opinion. Is Cooler really going to beat Jiren? Hold on. Not on my watch. Nope. Not on my watch. Hold on. Hold on. If worse comes to worse... Oh, all right. Well, you know what? We blitzed him with our eyes, literally into the volcano itself. I mean, Jiren... I mean, who could really hate Jiren, right? People say, oh, he doesn't have a character. He doesn't have a back... So, man, Jiren is Jiren, just straight up. So let's go on ahead and dive into the next fight to see what we got coming up ahead. Okay, so the second I saw these two... I mean, first and foremost, look at this. We have Mastered Ultra Instant Goku Black fusing with, I guess, Corrupted Future Zamasu to create this version of Omni... Corrupt Zamasu wielding Ultra Inst. Listen, I don't know. He just looks cool. Omni Zamasu has always been someone that I, I really liked in this game, right? I mean, at least for the modded feature, right? I've said this so many times before, but look at this. I have Raikon skin on Goku. I completely forgot to take that off, but it is what it is. We're going to go ahead and create Gogeta, and this is when we're going to have Gogeta versus Zamasu, right? Look at this, look at this. The power of Super Saiyan God, mind you, not Super Saiyan Blue. So I'm starting things off with Zamasu and that this is not good. This is if, if Gogeta beats me, then so be it. I really doubt that God Gogeta can get it done. You are gonna have fanboys in the comments being like, no, God Gogeta would be enough. I doubt that to be the case when you're fighting an immortal being, right? So I think Blue would Blue would settle it, but I, I would only hate for the fusion time to run out. You get what I'm saying? So Zamasu putting in the work, slapping around this so-called deity. That's right, that's right. Oh, kick them right into the stomach, into the asteroid he goes. Who's next? Who's next on the hit list? Super Saiyan 4 Gogeta. Listen to me very carefully. For those that are still going to argue that Super Saiyan 4 Gogeta solo super, I'm sorry, I respectfully disagree. There is no way. I would love to see a fight like this because 
I mean, look, look at the speed blitz behind this. I, I, what I really hated about GT was seeing how Gogeta never took Omega serious. I hate that about the fusions, right? But this, this would be interesting. I still think that Zamasu slaps. I still think Beerus slaps. I mean, some people might say, hell no. I, nah, I, I, I still stand by that idea. And Gogeta, listen, what the hell is going on? Am I about to lose? I hope not. This dude is really running roughshod on all my characters. Let me see if I can put him down with Beerus. Hopefully I can. Let me see. I, I, I want to use my Hakai, but I really, really doubt it. I'm going to be... See, look at that. I, I doubt I'm going to be able to pull, uh, pull it off because this dude, this dude's like... Uh, he's, a, he's a tank. He's, he's, just straight, he's straight up a tank. All right. So the last the last fusion is Kefla, which everybody seems to hate the, um, Kefla just as a whole, right? I mean, throughout my years of being here, I've seen so much hate for Kefla. More hate for Kefla than I would say anybody else. And as you just saw, I failed by using my Hakai. I completely forgot that I'm supposed to grab you. So let me see if I can make up for this, right? Let me see if I can flick her. All right, we got Cell. <laughs> Perfect. Let me see if I can go ahead and crush her crush her spine, break her back there for a second, you know? Cell, Perfect Cell, the backbreaker himself. If Kefla ends up beating Cell, then I'm gonna have no other choice but to solo her with Beerus, which I think Cell might do it. But let me see. I need to, I wanna use that Kamehameha. Come on, Cell. Don't let me down, Cell. Damn you, Cell. Come on, Cell. Damn it. Oh, okay. So we just, we're, we're gonna punch her right in the snout. Okay. We're gonna punch her right in the pooch. Cell, Cell did it. You know what? Before we end this, before we end this, one more fight is needed. One more fight is definitely needed right now. Okay. So I know this one really doesn't make any sense, but I was like, you know what? I have to bring in my boy, Teen Gohan. Teen Gohan was great. I mean, when he transformed into a Super Saiyan 2, the whole shtick, you guys already know the deal, but we're going to be fighting the God of Destruction himself, the one that I was just using and failing to Hakai Kefla with, right? So let me see if Gohan maybe can get the job done. So I have different variations of MUI. I have Boo on the other team as well, as well as Vegeta. So this is going to be a... Uh, it's gonna be a little interesting here, but either way, I mean, I I remember when looking back, we did so many different kinds of what-if battles that now, more or less, we don't really do them as much, but I remember when we first started this, I think if we went back to 2012, I would probably beg the question of doing, like, Beerus versus, you know, Super Saiyan 3 Vegito, because I think I used to do that back in the day, right? So, using different versions of MUI Goku, of course, we have MUI Goku Black, who is an absolute beast. I mean, the, his texture, everything about him, I think, is great. And is he really going to slice and dice me? Please, God, no. I'm not trying to lose this. And now we got the adaptation of Super Saiyan God Ultra Instinct. I mean, listen, I don't know. The hair looks cool. The aura on him looks really, really cool. So that's all she wrote on that one. But I mean, just looking at games like this, like the uh, the maps, the characters, uh, it's just, it's great. But let me see. I, I, yo, Black is really, he's really hammering it down. I, I do not want to lose to him, to be honest. But right now, Goku's adapting, I guess, God with Ultra Instinct. I mean, listen, I don't know. I mean, just stacking stacking one on top of the other, right? And and Boo wants him too. Boo wants to smoke. Listen, you're going to get all the smoke. You're going to get all the smoke on today's video. Nope. All the smoke needed. And fighters, listen, if you guys want to see more fighters, just let me know in the comment section below. And I'll make sure to do more fighters for you guys in the foreseeable future. But let me go ahead and just run rough shot on the other team. Because if I don't, damn it, he ate me. Please don't. Oh, is he, re is he really? He did. Damn, dude. Okay. Okay, Boo Boo got the better of me. This would have been interesting, even though the end result obviously would have been Boo mopping Super Saiyan 2 Teen Gohan. I mean, for those that are going to be like, nah, nah, you're, you're, you're bugging if you think that, right? So, we've narrowed it down. Here comes Beerus. All right, so now it's going to be a two-on-two. -two. This is interesting because, oh, yeah. Oh, yeah, right there. Yep. Did we get him? All right, one more maybe, one more. Can we get one more? Damn it. I want to see if I can at least use that on black. Let me see. If I can unleash that father-son Kamehameha to be like the be-all end all of this, that'd be great. Uh, damn it, my controller is not working. Black is gonna... Yo, I really hope he doesn't get the better of me. Please, Gohan, survive. Please, please, Gohan. You only have one job. Just use the Kamehameha. Use the Kamehameha to the best of your ability. He's... Yeah, he's gonna torture me. This is crazy. This is nuts. Okay, Gohan's gone. Wow, dude. 10 year Annie, and we're getting slapped around. Not today. We're not. Hold on. Time for us to use Goku. This could be a hit or a miss. Let me see. Let me see. If he beats me, I'm going to be so angry. Hold on. Hold on. Come on. All right. You know what? F it, right? A backhand will do. So that was insane. This is so fun. This game, if you guys have it, go back, play it, play it with friends, play it by yourself. It's a dope game. So let's go on ahead and jump into the next game to see what we got coming up ahead.
Okay, so it can't really be a 10-year anniversary video without Saints Row. I don't know what's going on in the background, but what I do know is this. Someone's about to get RPG'd. My God, bro. Look at this. Look at the carnage. See, this is what the game was all about way back in the day before. Damn, I got three stars. Uh-oh. Hold on. All right. So we got the Kapos after me. So I remember beating this game as, of course, you guys can see I have infinite stamina. I have infinite health. I think I do have infinite health. Uh, is that the opposition? I think it is. All right. So I want to go in ahead and cause havoc. So you guys have seen me play countless, countless Saints Row games on the channel. And I remember this was supposed to be my old character by the name of Titan, right? It was like some old cringy stuff. But either way, I want to go back to this and I'm playing this on the 360. So I had to pull teeth just for me to be able to do this. Um, all right, so as you guys can see, I have infinite ammo. This is way different than Saints Row 2. I mean, you guys have, whoa, what was that? You see, yo, what is he, like the Flash? You see that? Yo, these dudes have like abilities and like, I, I gotta get the hell out of here, dude. I don't wanna get mopped by the opposition. This is supposed to be still water, right? Let me go ahead, oh my God, open parachute, yes. Oh, okay, that was that was just terrible. Uh, all right, so I have entered the suburban neighborhood. So the goal here, I guess, is to destroy as many uh, things as I as I physically can before I end up dying. If I can actually die, you just saw that, right? I shot this dude like seventy five times in the penis, and he didn't go down. Uh, what else do I have here? Uh, I have Molotov cocktails. I have the uh, what is this supposed to be? Oh, the airstrike. I remember this. I gotta get the hell out of dodge. Watch this. Watch this. I used to love this weapon. Ba boom it just eradicates everybody except for this guy this is this is why i like this game so much and i want to go back and play it because i remember showcasing this my god the only thing that's missing is like environmental damage you feel me outside of that this game was just fun uh oh hold on watch this if i'm gonna call for like a nuclear or whatever the hell this is like an airstrike watch this Boom! Destroy the entire neighborhood. I really wish this game had, like, the mechanics that it has now to, like, destroy these buildings and stuff like that. So, let me see how far I can actually go without perishing in battle, right? So, I want to thank you all so much for uh, tuning in during this time, you know, on my channel. Because I, I remember Saints Row, before it went to uh, Saints Row the 4th or whatever, Saints Row the 3rd was definitely a game. Oh, hell yeah, dude. Yep. Oh, you want to run me over? Watch this. Perfect time to die. Watch this. Watch this. Ba boom Destroys everybody. Before Saints Row became what it is now, this game was so heavily gang-filled and stuff like that. I, I used to love it. I used to love it for what it was, right? But this is this is the 10-year Annie, so I want to go on ahead and just shoot everything, shoot everybody. If I end up... Oh, what the hell was that? Did my rocket just... Oh, did my rocket just like deflect itself and go somewhere else you know i'm causing a lot of havoc and i'm so surprised that i haven't gotten like five stars by now uh the cops are fighting i guess other gang members and stuff like that i'm assuming what is gang members right all right let me go on ahead and just blow everything up the point here is to get five stars if i can actually as, as a matter of fact oh hell yeah you guys are in for it now bam this was my oh uh, is that is that the SWAT? Yes, it is. SWAT team goes down. Okay, so I still got three stars. I, I honestly don't know why. I'm trying to get four. I'm trying to get five. Look at this. Yes, absolute mayhem. I'm gonna shoot ever. Oh, they got tanks. That's right. I forgot this game had tanks, but these tanks can't stand up to me. All right, so we got four stars. I'm trying to get to five. Come on, come on, come on, come on. Did it hit something? Did it hit something? It hit nothing. Come on. Oh, that sucks. All right, come on, come on, hit something, hit that car, hit that car. How did it not hit that car? It hit something out there, right? But I do want to get your thoughts. Is it going to hit that car? Oh, oh, hell yeah, yeah, now we're in for it. Yep, lock on to the chopper, that's it, lock on to that heli. Oh, that's beautiful, beautiful. All right, so, damn, these dudes are coming at me with weapons of mass destruction. This is what I'm talking about, dude. This is what the channel was built off. Ooh, this is what the channel was built off of, like, back in, like, 2013, 2012. Hold up, hold up. I want to get those five stars, dude. I want to get that. What the hell's going on with my RPG? It's, like, all over the place. All right, let me just get this going. Still four stars. What do I have to do to, like, get to five stars? I am invincible. This is, like, Zamasu's wet dream. I got to get the hell out of here. There, There's, like, absolute just havoc happening all over the place i believe saints row 4 is the game where i deal with like superpowers and stuff which is just bs right all right uh what else can i do oh yeah grenades empanadas all over the place yeah we're throwing amp oh did that chopper just get hit by one of my grenades first of all how in the hell 
I don't even know what's happening right now, dude. What else do I have here? All right, so I have... I have dual semi-autos, right? These guys are locked on their turrets and stuff. Th this is how the movie Army of the Dead started, I kid you not. It was it was some very overpoweredly super dynamic character, I guess, that just stepped in. This is nuts. Let me use my shoddy. This shoddy ain't gonna do much. Ampanada's inbound! Yo, they're, they're shoot- oh, wait, 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 hold on. They're, they're, they're actually shooting that tank at me, dude, like... Nah, this is still water, homie. This is still water. This is this is where the gang members run the run the streets. Alright, let me get the hell out of here. This is just absolute anarchy. So my thing is I, I would definitely uh oh. Oh yeet! Ooh, he didn't yo, listen. It's it's over. It's it's done. Oh, we got five stars. Perfect. Alright, so we're gonna fight in the middle of this intersection. Yo, these dudes oh, oh wow, how do I get smacked by a telephone pole? Are you kidding me right now? Yo, how the hell did you just see that? My rocket launcher shot just came back at me. Boom. If, uh, my word of advice is this. I don't know what that dude's doing. Oh, is, is he dead? Let me just make sure he's dead. My word of advice is for you guys to go back and play this game. If you have it on your 360, on your PS3s, if you guys just so happen to have it on your Xbox Series Xs, or the PlayStation 5, it's if it's available. Oh, this dude got a flamey? Nah, homie. Oh, he's tough. Wait a minute, wait a minute. Whoa, 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 hold on. Before you try to set me on fire. Yeah. Yeah, you ain't so tough now, are you? Yo, this game is chaotic. Compared to 2, this is... This is chaos. But this is what the channel was built off of, like, 10 years ago. And we got we got so much more coming, you know what I'm saying? So much more coming. We had we had to go back to some of the, uh, the classic games that built the channel. Do I want to get inside one of these cars? Not really. These dudes have abilities to just run, dash... Like, Jesus. I, I forgot what their names were. Was it the Ronin, right? Or something like that? Maybe I'm just tripping. I don't know. Yo, damn, they're they're all over the place. We got we got the army versus Oh, did he just throw that guy at me? Come on, dude. Seriously? Oh, they're all fighting. This is all out anarchy. You better get the hell away from me, dude. I'm gonna I'm gonna destroy everybody. Hell, I'll even destroy myself if I have to. Damn, 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 damn. Listen, I would hate I I would hate to be the, the family that lives in this house because all you're seeing outside is just mayhem right just absolute mayhem uh let me get the hell okay first of all let me get rid of all of you because y'all are starting to annoy me let me just get rid of this tank because this tank thinks it can own me when it can't i am the mighty titan in this game that that was my uh that was my character's name in this game titan he he looks like i don't know just <laughs> what is this the gothedral okay i see what you did there blasphemous blasphemous goth stuff I wish we did have environmental destruction during during this time, you know what I mean? What is happening behind me? Damn, dudes are trying to run me over. They're all following me and stuff. Alright, um, let me get into a vehicle. Look at that, they're using flash-like maneuvers against me. Let me get into- oh wait, oh, that was nice, that was- that was nice. Let me go in ahead and, uh, turn off the music here, we don't want any copyright. Alright, my- my- my wheels just got shot off. Okay, this is not how I imagine myself driving. Oh god. This is really going to mess me up. Uh, we're going to take the fight to the highway. I really doubt that we're going to lose uh, the police. Because, I mean, they're, they're bound to be all over the place, right? Let me go in it. Oh, 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 that was, that was, that was horrifying. Hold on, hold on. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. What did I do to deserve this? I, I, I what did I do? Uh oh, this is not good. This is not good. This is not good. Yeet. I got to get the hell out of here. Yeah, I, I have to jump out. Um... Yeah, you guys want all the smoke? Listen, I want all the smoke, too. Yep, everyone's gonna go. Everything is going. Thank God for my armor. You guys want smoke? You guys want smoke? Everyone gets smoke. Even the pedestrians. Even the poor, innocent pedestrians that have nothing to do with any of this. They're gonna get the smoke, too. All I wanted to do was enter the... Oh, crap. The city? Damn, this is nuts. This is nuts. Uh-oh, here comes the tank. Damn. Who the hell... Are, who are they aiming at? Did you see that? All right, two shots and it's done. All right, so I don't know what I got going on. I have five stars. I have five shield marks, right? I don't know. I mean, I, I I doubt I'm going to die. That's already a given. So what I think I'm going to do, even if I jump off of a building, I doubt I'm going to die. But this game is something, let me tell you. Definitely different than what it was during, you know, GTA 4's run. I think GTA 5 came out a little after Saints Row 4, or maybe during, something along those lines, you know what I mean? And Saints, oh, damn, this dude's, yo, you're trying to, hold on, let me, let me, let me double, oh, crap, 
I can't do that. Let me, let me, let me shoot this dude with double pistols. Yep. Damn. Down goes the behemoth. This is all out carnage. I can only imagine what Saints Row 4 was like. Because Saints Row 4, we had powers and all that stuff. So I, I might go back and do that. But I wanted to really showcase Saints Row 3 before anything else. Because Saints Row 3 was one of the first games that I've, that I've played on the channel. Um, Saints Row 2 came before I made the channel. So I really didn't play Saints Row 2 as much. But definitely Saints Row 3. Saints Row 3 was one of those games where we played it. It was cringy because we had some terrible equipment. We had some terrible quality, terrible mic. My mic was god-awful. It was god-awful. Why are these blue guys, like, chasing me? Like, who are you people? Like, for real. I, I, I'm really curious as to who these people are. And I'm going to stick with my RPG. Ooh, what the hell was that? Yo, y'all are crazy. Y'all really want me dead. I, I, ooh! I, yo, he protected his homie there for a second, I will say. Yeah, these dudes really want me gone, man. Uh, quick. Get out the car. Get out the car. Get out the car. Time for us to get out of here. Time for us to skedaddle. My freaking, uh, oh, this is bad. This is bad. They're gonna, they're gonna blow my car up, dude. They're gonna blow my car up. Alright, so far, I mean... I'm running on like two wheels. Oh god, turn, turn. I forgot how to drift in this game. The drifting in this game is oh no. The drifting in this game. Oh, am I dead? I, wow, I, I really died. I really died. I really okay, so we can't die via RPG shots, via you know, massive, you know, M MG weapons just gunning you down. Like we can't die via that, but we can die via car accident, right? So that's that's interesting. I don't like you people. Boom! Alright. I'm, I'm gonna kill my own gang members too, just for the hell of it. Alright, so, time for us to cause- I, I really did not expect for us to go down that quickly. I, I, I swear to you, I did not. I, I swear to you, I did not. But, you know, look, look at these people here. They're just like, what's going on? Is this guy using his RPG to destroy the town? Yes, I am. Yes, I am. Yes, I freaking am. Time for me to shoot everything and everybody. And oh, no, I'm pissed. I'm pissed. So now, at least I know what I need to do in order to kind of like die, which is getting to uh, get into a car accident with uh, with the army. That's, that's, oh, we got the red dudes. Okay, so now instead of the blue guys coming after me, it's it's the red gang members. All right, we got the bloods. We got the parus coming after us. Who else wants smoke? I want smoke with everybody. There they are, the, the, the red gang bangers. And this is what made this game a little different. We got four stars real quick. Let me, uh, who's, go where, where's the chopper at? Yo, you, you guys are, you guys, you guys think you're tough, right? Come on, come on. Oh, d d really, bro? Come on. Yeet. He's on fire, but he's still alive. All right, let me gun this chopper down real quick. Yo, you think you're tough, right? You think you're tough? Not today, you're not. Time for us to skedaddle. So now at least I know what I need to do. So I just need to, I just need to get into a car and that's it. I want to get into a tank. Yo, give me your tank. No, no, no. Give me your tank. Give me your tank. I, I want in on the tank. Let me in the tank. Hold on. What is that guy? What is that guy? He looks like he's getting a blowjob. Let me just shoot him in the face. Let me go in ahead and shoot him in the face. All right. A am I able? Oh, I'm able to get in. Perfect. Perfect. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Look at this. Hold on. Hold on. Hold on. Hold on. H how do I? Okay, there we go. Yeah, this is what I'm talking about. We got the big tanks. Yeah, there's no way these guys can... I mean, this is a really slow tank. It's super, super, super slow. Maybe maybe it wasn't the best of options to jump into this when I have, like, my invincible character that can just take everybody out via just taking a piss on them. So, hopefully they don't take me out this early. But also, I, I, I want to know your first impressions on this game. I do want to get your thoughts on everything essentially about Saints Row. You know, like, you know what I mean? It's, it's unfortunate to see the way this game kind of went down the drain, because it did, right? I think the original studio went out of business, and then they just kept creating these convoluted ideas that contradicted the game's narrative and stuff like that, so... Damn, look at this. I, I, I would literally be listed as, like, the most dangerous person probably in history. Ooh! Oh, that's not good. Hold on, hold on. Y'all want to shoot me like that? All right, bet. Y'all wanna, y'all wanna throw smoke? Oh, okay, alright. I want all the smoke. I want all the smoke. Everybody is going to get got right now. Unless I jump into a vehicle where I feel comfortable, then yeah. Oh, that's a nice car. Hold up, hold up, hold up. That's a really nice car. What is this? Let me go ahead and jump into this. Alright, let's go ahead and just 
drive our way out of here. Oh, it's a really fast car, too. Hold on. What's my drifting? Oh, can I drift? Damn it, that's not what I wanted. Oh, here they come. They're coming at me, man. I'm just trying to I'm just trying to drive my way out. Oh, no, 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 not, 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 not the army. Not the army. Not the army. Not the army. I, I don't want the SWAT team. I don't want anybody gunning me down. Nah, homie. Listen, if, if I die again, that's when I guess I'm going to end the portion of the video off. But I don't want to... Uh, I don't know. Let's see. Let's see. Let's see. Notoriety. Yeah, I'm trying to get some notoriety. You feel me? I'm trying to... Uh-oh. Yo, he nearly got me. He nearly got me. He nearly got me. Um, I need to drift, drift, drift. Oh, go. Oh, nah, 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 nah. We, we out of here. Nope. Nope. I am not sacrificing that. That was, that was too close. Is my car gone? Yeah, my car is gone. Oh, uh, you guys. You guys really want me dead, huh? Yeet. A day's work. Oh, crap. I wish you can actually, you know, like, I I'm still waiting for the day where we're able to do, like, literally anything in games like this. Like, enter buildings, any building you want. You know, just do whatever. Like, that's that's what I really, I was hoping for that, like, you know, in the future or whatever. So, let me go on ahead and run. Let me see if I can escape. I, I don't want to escape, I guess, the police, right? I want to continue to just cause chaos everywhere. I, I guess I'm in the industrial portion here. I remember playing this game. I'm not entirely sure if I've if I've ever done a uh, let's play on this. Probably not. I think I just played it just to play it. Where's the chopper? Where's the chopper at? Uh-oh. Hold on. SWAT team's here. Nah, nah, nah. You guys are able to endure a lot, but yeet. Come on, come on, shoot, shoot that, shoot that heli, shoot the heli, shoot the heli, come on, shoot, shoot, damn it, shoot, there we go, nice, let's get the hell out of here, dude, I want to only imagine that my armor is, like, saving me from this, even though I know that once you beat the game, you basically become invincible, but I want to see if these, uh, if these ass clowns are gonna follow me through the alleyway, are they, oh, they are, damn, come on, gangbangers, get them, they're ign oh, oh, they got them, damn, Yo, my gang members fell. Damn. And here I thought they were actually going to be able to, like, help me out here. So much for having a crew, right? My crew went down quicker than, than pedestrians did. Oh, crap. This is not good. Come on. I got to get the hell out of here, dude. I want to jump into one of their, like, vehicles here. But I know these, these crappy things. Oh, there goes the ambulance. Oh, wait, wait. Hold on, hold on. Yeet. Did we get him? Oh, no, 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 no. Don't redirect that in the building. Yep, take down the chopper. Perfect. I want to get into, um, instead of getting into, like, the SWAT vehicles, whatever, I want to get into, like, those military... Th yeah, these right here. Let me get into one of those. Yo, let me in. Let me in, let me in, let me in, let me in. Oh, my God, can I, can I not walk slower? All right, here we go, here we go. Yep, I'm in the big bear. I'm in the bear. All right, perfect. This this thing is like, and to think that the actual military and stuff have vehicles like this. Listen, I I, I promise you right now, if I die, then we'll end it. But I, I think I'm gonna live on for quite quite a little bit of time. Let's see. Definitely not GTA San Andreas vibes, where we just touch things with the tank and then it just blows up. But I want to see how fast I can go. I want to see how 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 much impact we can create by crashing into a car. Let me see. Uh, let me see. Oh, that's perfect. Boom! Oh, wait a minute. Did we do more damage to ourselves? Where's the car? <laughs> Where the hell is the car? Hold on. Look at that. We have a machine gun mounted and everything. Thankfully enough... Look at that. Look at that. Boom! Down goes... Oh, they have spike strips. Thank God we didn't fall under those spike strips. Look at the cops. The cops are like, stop in the name of the law. Stop it, you. Oh, crap. Oh, crap. I did not mean to drive this way. Come on, come on, come on. Am I on fire? I was about to say. Uh-oh. That's not... Oh, he nearly got me. Yeet! Oh, we skidded over the tank! Yes! 10-year anniversary for the for Unreal and Gaming, dude. Jumping over tanks and everything. Just shooting cars. This is brilliant. Down go the pedestrians. Down go... This is... I, I, I love the bear. The bear, is, the bear is pretty cool. The bear is effective. I think the bear is effective. We're just about, I would say, almost 20 minutes into this portion of the game, and, and so far it's just been freaking anarchy. But I, I really don't like it to where, um, as soon as I end up, like, hitting another vehicle, like, head-on, for whatever reason, I just, like, my car just flies up in the air. It's like, come on. That's, that's not what I want. You feel me? Oh, God. Oh, God. Where am I going? I have no idea where I'm going. I have not checked the maps. I have not checked anything to, like, kind of secure my location here so it is what it is 
But this this is one very heavy vehicle. Like there's no way. I lost the uh, the stars. So let me boom. Oh god. All right, let me. Oh crap. They they they're they're after me, dude. They are after. I need I need a fast car though. Is this a fast car? I have no idea. I'm about to jump into it and test it out. It's, it probably is. All right, yeet! I mean, the the realistic the realistic aspect of the game goes out the window. Oh, oh, we got crushed! Holy, well, that goes there goes my vehicle. That was insane. That was really insane. That was really really insane. Damn it, man! Wow. Now it can't be a 10 year anniversary without Dragon Ball Z Raging Blast 2. This used to be one of my favorite games of all time. And I got a really special battle for you guys here today. Super Saiyan 3 Broly versus Gogeta. We have a team battle coming up and let me see if I can go in ahead and get the better of our boy Gogeta right now. I remember I used to do what if battles on this channel involving like what if this person fought this person and stuff like that. So. I, I really do appreciate you guys for being here throughout all of it because we used to do like some crazy stuff. You guys can go back and look at it on my channel. Let me see if I can just grab here. Omega Blaster. Yep, there goes. Is Gogeta still up? Yeah, he's still there. And by the way, I do want to know. So Super Saiyan Gogeta versus, I guess you could say Super Saiyan 3 Broly, right? This is only from Z. I don't want you guys to incorporate elements from Super and stuff like that. But let me go on ahead and get rid of Gogeta here. I, I don't want him to get the better of me as a matter of fact i want to see if i can actually use my ultimate move here i want to go in ahead and just lock this dude oh, oh oh hold on hold on hold on hold on let me see gigantic buster oh he countered me oh he countered me hold on let's get rid of uh let's go ahead and get rid of gogeta here but i remember nearly 10 years ago we used to play this game a lot in 2012 2013 and stuff like that uh oh hold on hold on hold on hold on uh oh wait a minute wait a minute no 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 that's not what we want happening no no oh this is bad this is bad. Hold on, hold on. Let me see. Broly, come on. Do the gigantic buster. There we go. Finally. I was about to say, am I not able to actually land this? But I remember nine, eight, ten years ago, a lot of you guys found me through my what if battles, you know, and, and discussions on this game. I was one of the first people to ever actually do, you know, like what if discussions and stuff like that on this channel involving games like this. And it was really cringy. It was really, really bad. But I remember so many of my current friends and so many other YouTubers found me through this. And it was insane. So down goes Gogeta, who's next? Gohan. Yes, Ultimate Gohan versus Super Saiyan 3 Broly. Let me go on ahead and uh, let me swap out. I want to go on ahead and swap out with Super Saiyan 3 Vegeta. There he is. This was one of the very few games that had like those what if concepts, which I really enjoyed. And what's crazy too is I've noticed some of you guys really didn't like Raging Blast 2 compared to 1, so I do want to get your thoughts in the comment section below as to which game you guys liked more. Was it Raging Blast 1, or was it Raging Blast 2? Let me go ahead and get the better of Gohan real quick. You think you're tougher than me, bro? See, honestly, I I, I think, I think on my channel, uh, 10 years ago, damn it, he countered me. I think I did a discussion where I talked about, like, oh, what, what if Super Saiyan 3 Vegeta fought, like, a hypothetical concept of, of Ultimate Gohan, during the same time frame, right? So I, I guess I'll still ask the question now. Who do you guys think would win? Ultimate Gohan or uh, Super Saiyan 3 Vegeta? Let me go ahead and smack him. Yep, 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 and boom! I really want to hit him with one of my uh, one of my attacks, but he's countering me like crazy. All right, there we go. Come on, Vegeta. Gallic Impact. Look at that, I love that. He just approaches you from behind and then puts his hand there and then bam, just blasts you. And if you guys have not checked out the mods and stuff, you guys need to check it out because I, I was often one of those people that wanted to see mods. And back during like 2012, 2013, I was like, dude, I, I wish this game actually had mods. You feel me? It's over for Gohan. Look at this anime. I love the cinematic kind of like, you know, feel of how this game like portrays itself when you're about to unleash like, like, like an ultimate and stuff like that. It, like, it makes it feel so good. Oh, it's it's done. It's done. Vegeta's about to sneak up behind homie, put his hand there. Be gone, Gohan. It's done. I, I want to swap out for somebody, though. Go down goes Gohan. Who's next? Oh, Janemba. Okay. So we're going to swap out for our boy, Kid Buu. Aw, oh, damn it. I used to hate this. I used to hate this. I used to be so quick when doing this. Not so much anymore. I mean, 10 years, 10 years later, I I've, I've fallen off of grace in trying to keep up with the mechanics of uh, being able to match these buttons. Oh, this is bad. Oh, we got one. We got one. 
10 years later. I want to thank you guys so much for just always being here. Like, it really means a lot to me. Um, again, not entirely sure what the future holds. Uh, there is that chance that we could be doing more of this in the future and stuff like that, but it really all varies. Uh, Janemba wants to smoke, huh? All right, Janemba. Let me see. Yep. Planet burst. It's done. Oh, he stopped me. You dirty rascal, you. Hold on. Hold on. He actually went on to stop me from using my planetary destroyer? Are you out of your mind? Nah. Vengeance shall be mine, ladies and gents. Oh, damn. That, that freaking sword attack. Nah, he's, he's done. He's done. Yep. We got him. We got him. We got him, folks. It's done. I mean, you have to appreciate what this game used to do. Like, you feel me? This game used to do so much, and, and it still does. Like, I mean... It, it holds up very well after like what this game came out like in 2009 2008 right so, somewhere along those lines this game is really old i mean let's just put it that way it's not as old as like tenkaichi but you know it's 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 up there you feel me all right let me let me sneak up behind him Yeet. all right what else can i do here yes the mystic ball attack i used to love this boo just masking himself just smacking janemba around bam what are you gonna do janemba huh you want some smoke and some of y'all might be asking me, yo, Alex, you should go back and do more of these, like, what if, what if battles for uh, Raging Blast. To be honest, I think, I think my days of doing what if battles on games like this are long and, uh, long and done. You feel me? But if you guys go back and you watch some of my older stuff, you can see the difference. Like, you can see the difference in quality. You can see the difference in, in comparison to where I was. Yeah, Planet Burster, it's done. You're gonna fall. Nah, you're gonna fall, homie. Boom. That spells the end of Janemba. I want to go ahead and swap out for my boy, uh, Future Gohan. Oh, we got Super Boo. All right. Let the, uh, Super Boo versus Kid Boo debates begin in the comment section again, right? All right, let me see here. Let me just... Maybe, maybe I might be able to do this. Who knows? Let's see, let's see. I need to be quick on my toes. There we go. A, hey, come on, come on. I need to get the better... Oh, damn it. I clicked the wrong button. No! Come on, come on, come on. There we go. We got it. Was I able to do it? There we go. Now, Future Gohan was really, really cool in this game, and you guys are gonna see why. Uh, some of some of what he does is like really, really cool. So let me go on ahead and just get up in his face. Oh, did he? Did he really? What did he do? All right, hold on, hold on. Wait, wait, no, no, no. I don't want to do the wild sense. There we go. Come on, Gohan. And listen, if if Boo gets a little intense, then we're just gonna up it up by doing this. Look at the animation behind the transformations. This is so clean. Like, I mean, you can't doubt some of these older Dragon Ball games in, in what they can do. Now, I, I've done a gaming roulette video. I believe it was last year during December. Oh, okay. So you, so you want all the smoke then. All right. Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. You want all the smoke, right? Watch this. I, I love this. The fierce combination. Look how incredible this, this animation is of Gohan just whooping ass. Look at that. Just slamming him down. Boom. Jumping back for the one-armed Kamehameha. Oh my god, 10 years of this. 10 years, man. I appreciate you guys so much, man. This is this is such nostalgia. All right, let me just get behind him. Boom, let me just do my, my uh, special beam cannon. A tribute to my real father, Piccolo. And now we're going to do this. The fierce combination again. Can we get a lock on him? There we go. Yo, beautiful. Beautiful. I'm not sure if he's the final opponent. Maybe. I, I don't think he is. I think Metal Cooler is the last one. But just capping things off with a one-arm Kamehameha. It's done. That's it. That's that's all she wrote for Boo. He's flying through the rocks. What else do we have here? Who's the last opponent? Is is it Metal Cooler? I think it is. There he is. Metal Kuda. All right, Cooler. Let's get down to business. Who do you guys got? Future Goal Hunter Metal Cooler. I mean, the, <laughs> the toxicity of, 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 the, of the questions. I used to do some really, really random questions back in the day. It was like first form Frieza versus like... Android 17 and stuff like that. It was like so weird. You feel me? It was like un unnecessary stuff. The hyper. Oh, we got him. We got him. Hold on. Hold on. All right. Come on, cooler. What you got, cooler? What you got? What you got? What you got? It's been it's been 10 years, and your boy still got the fire, and your boy still got the fire. We're gonna swap out for our boy, full powered Super Saiyan 3 Broly. And the mods for this game are quite unique because we've had modders attempt to do so much. But do you guys remember back in the day? I was an advocate for the Raging Blast 3 project. Unfortunately, it has been many, many years since the Raging Blast 3 project. And uh, I was an advocate. I really wanted to see the Raging Blast 3 project come into fruition. I was one of the first ones. Uh-oh. 
Oh hell no, oh hell no, oh hell no. Yep, yeah, we dodged everything. Oh wait, all oh, the gigantic hammer, yes. Let me let me get close. Let me get close. Hold on. Alright, cooler. Work oh, oh he did he really just counter me? Did he really just counter me? Nah, 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 nah. I do not want to lose Broly. I do not. Hold on, hold on. Yeet! Oh, did he counter me again? Cooler. Listen, cooler. Gig oh, oh he oh damn! Damn, yo, this this cooler, this cooler is really on his. He, oh, he's on his stuff. Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. We're gonna have to, we're gonna have to bounce back from this. Hold on, let's power up, cause I'm on the brink of death and he's not. So there we go. Can I use it? How did he counter again? That's that's ridiculous. Broly, no, Broly, no. Do not fall to Metal Cooler, Broly. No, 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 no. We are not going to fall to him. No, nope, we are not. We are not. We are not. Nope, 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 nope. Yay, yay, yay. Can we do it? Can we do it? How is he countering me? Uh-oh. The lock-on buster. Am I really gonna lose Broly? Am I really seriously about to lose Broly? I did. Are you kidding me? I have to cap him. I have to cap him off. I have to. Oh, Vegito. Oh, that's right. I completely forgot I had my boy Vegito here. What's up, Cooler? How you doing, buddy? You remember me? I used to love that finger attack. Hey. No pun intended, right? All right, so watch this. Time for us to enter Super Vegito. Oh, you're you, listen. You're about to get turned to dust. He's about to get dusted. I don't care what attack he hits me with. He's about to get dusted. He's about to get faded. The beam sword. There we go. That's right. Vegito coming in with the clutch. Spirit sword to the face. Yeah, it's it's done. And now I'm about to cap off this portion of the video by having our boy commence. With his fearsome Kamehameha. Watch this, watch this. Yep, you ain't got no chance. You ain't got no chance for the final Kamehameha. Capping it off, boy. Oh, he countered. You dirty little girl, you. Yo, this dude is strong. What the hell? I was not expecting for Metal Cooler to give me this much of a hard time. All right, Cooler. All right. Listen, you may be hitting me with these key blasts, but you're about to get smoked. Final Kamehameha. It's done. It's done. Capping this. Oh, we got him. That's all she wrote, folks. Oh my goodness. Again, thank you all so much for watching this portion. We have so much more coming. So much more coming. I mean, how could we do a 10 year anniversary video without Call of Duty Zombies? Except this time, we're playing some mods. And I decided, oh my goodness, I decided to go on ahead and jump in and play a little bit, I guess, before we uh, started recording. So I am currently on round number 19 and I want to see if I can actually get as far as I can and I remember I used to showcase a lot of zombies on my channel oh crap right around the time of I would say 2012 2013 a lot of you guys may remember we used to do a lot of like black ops 2 zombies so I want to thank you all so much for being here we got the wonder weapon well wonder what we wonder waffle weapon oh my god I have zombies smacking my ass which threw me off my uh my balance here but nonetheless look at this Kame's house man Roshi's Roshi's palace right we were at the sex the sex island and I want to thank you all so much for just being here I guess from the beginning right you have to love that look at Goku man he looks uh, he looks beautiful he looks beautiful and and it's, it's crazy because thus far I only have mods for Black Ops 3 zombies I'm not entirely too sure if they as in the community have gone on to mod any of the modern COD games, but you know, to my knowledge, I think the Workshop for Steam holds a lot more uh, mods and stuff in the Workshop for Black Ops 3 than any other COD. Here we go. Time to wet everybody up. Look at this. I, I don't care who's standing in my path. Yep, everyone's about to get the smoke. I am looking to just get smoke with everyone. I, I am looking to get smoke with everyone. Look at that. All of them are down. All right, so. I want to see how far I can actually go, and I want to thank you all so much, especially those that have been around for longer than I would say like seven years, right? Seven, eight, nine, ten years. It's been a journey, and I really, I've evolved as a creator. Hopefully, you guys could tell um, quality-wise in terms of, you know, professionalism and stuff like that. Um, I always tend to be like very high energy when it comes to my Dragon Ball videos and stuff like that. Like, you know what I mean? What's going on, guys? Welcome back. You know what I mean? Like, I'm always high energy. Um, I guess the only time where I'm just, like, chill is when I'm playing, like, games like this on the gaming roulette. Yo, these dudes are everywhere. I want to see. I really, really want to see how far we can go, though. Ampanada's inbound. 
Ampanadas inbound. Are, are, we, are, we, are we mopping some zombies? We're barely mopping them. That's not good. Uh, I think I'm going to have to up, upgrade my ray gun again. But either way, you guys have seen me play this before. You guys have seen me play uh, COD Zombies multiple times. And I want to thank you all so much for just like sticking on by and enjoying it. And, and I really hope you guys watch through the entire video because I got some other really, really cool games that I think you guys are really going to enjoy. Uh, talk about like Mugen games and just some other stuff as well, you know what I mean? Um, but I remember back when I first started my channel, I was doing so much. And, and here's what I'm going to... Here's a little a gem that, that I want to share with you guys. So... What really motivated me to try even harder on this platform was in 2014, and this may sound dumb, but I, I remember this because it stuck with me, right? In 2014, there was a person that left a comment on one of my videos, and he was basically saying, oh, your, your channel's dead, you, like, nobody cares about your channel, you know, your content is this, and... You know, like, like just all, all this negativity, right? And I remember I, I went to work, because I used to work in a bank. I went to work, and I was so down. I was like, damn, like, I don't know why that comment really stuck with me. You know what I mean? Uh, maybe it's because it held a little bit of merit, because at the time in 2014, I was doing all kinds of videos on my channel that were just so random, and I didn't really know what my audience wanted for a long time, because I just figured, let me just be me and just throw everything that I love on my channel and I, I said to myself I have to be more professional I have to carry myself like a professional I have to make sure that I do uh, things that my audience wants because imagine you sub you know you, you subscribe to my channel and you sub for Dragon Ball or you sub for games and stuff like that and all of a sudden I'm doing cooking videos right like nobody's gonna want to care about that like you know what I mean so from a business perspective I, I understood the elements of that person's comment but it really brought me down and it actually motivated me to try even more than what i what i already was like you know what i mean so that that was like the that was like the sparking point uh in 2014 i i, I definitely want to say 2014 um it, i don't think it was 2015 it was definitely 2014 for sure and that was like again two years after i started unreal and gaming you know what i mean but I, again, like your your criticism, and you know what I care about? I care about fair criticism. Like if you're gonna tell me, yo Alex, improve your audio, yo Alex, um, up up your quality in terms of like uh, disabling, resampling, you know, your your content and stuff like that, like just increasing the the frame rates, and you know, like that that that's good criticism to have. Uh, calling me an idiot or just telling someone that they're you know stupid or whatever or they don't know something that's not really criticism you know what i mean that's just an insult so i want to thank you all so much for just giving me the fair criticism that i deserved for me to become a better creator without that um you know i, I wouldn't have gotten as far as i am now you know what i mean um and, and don't get me wrong like if, if you want to be a creator it's not easy it's not easy on this platform especially now in 2022 and going forward you feel me um because nowadays everybody wants to be a creator nowadays everyone wants to do something or just be the same um there is oh crap there is a lack of diversity on this platform meaning nowadays everyone's doing the same they want to be the same um me i try so hard to be different and many other people do as well so my only thing is if you want to be a creator do something that's different do something that makes you stand out you feel me so because there were so many things that i did that all of a sudden other youtubers started copying and doing you know what i mean like i remember i was the first one you guys can check this on the platform 10 years ago nine years ago eight years ago i was one of the first ones to do fan manga then everyone copies you know and just various other things as well but you know you, you always have to be humble too you can't just you know go around being like yeah i'm hot shit like you know that's that's not the mentality i i i had because i knew coming up on this platform my content was you know at the time in the beginning it was it was trash my audio was god, god awful i i didn't know anything about like um improving frame rates and just uh rendering on on good quality settings you know what i mean i used to use my first ever capture card was was something called the adapt tech game bridge it was terrible like you know what i mean but you guys helped me so i have to thank you so much for that roshi's island dude i mean listen this island is like full of blood guts and just bodies as soon as roshi ends up coming back from the strip club he's just gonna notice a bunch of bodies on his freaking on his doorstep all right 
Um, I need, I, what, what do I need here? Actually, as a matter of fact, yes, let me do this. Let me upgrade my wonder weapon for sure. Come on, come on, come on. Give me a stiff biff. All right, let me uh, upgrade the dingo. Hurry up, hurry up, hurry up, hurry up, hurry up. Come on. All right, dire wolf. Here we go. Wolf pack. Oh, crap. I was about to say, I hope I don't regret this. I hope I don't, you know, pack a punch this weapon, and then I end up regretting it, you feel me? But you know what's crazy? Like, what, 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 I really, what I really am humbled about... Damn, these dudes are everywhere. What I really am humbled about are all the people that... I was able to befriend on this platform. There were so many subscribers that turned into friends that I was able to meet in real life on, you know, just through Discord and stuff like that. It was insane. Like, so I have to thank this platform and I have to thank you guys so much for just always being here. And I really hope you guys are watching this portion of the video because this is some heavy stuff. I, I, I might, I might actually go down at a certain point. Let me see. Out of all games, I chose Black Ops 3. Oh, yes. Perfect. Yes. Oh, oh, no. No, no, no. Hold up. I have yet to use my... Oh, damn. You saw that? Damn. Get electrocuted, all of you. Yeah, the power of... The power of friendship. This is what it does. Yeet. Ooh. Wait, how did this guy not go down? What the hell? Damn, these dudes are coming at me. These dudes are coming at me. Hold on. Let me get rid of all of them. See, this is what the ray gun should do, and I think this is what the ray gun used to do on games like World at War, right? World at War used to feature, like, a really OP ray gun. Oh, this guy's about to get all the smoke. Yeet! Where's the last zombie? I hear him around here. There he is. Alright, wonderful. Is that it? No, it's not it. So what I'm gonna do right now is... I think I wanna get double tap. Any more zombies? No. There is one more, actually. I, I can actually... Oh, there he is. Yeet! Son Goku! Lend me your energy, dude! All right, perfect. Let me go ahead and grab this. Wonderful. All right, now we have double tap as well. Beautiful. Now, let me know in the comment section below if you guys want to see more of these modded videos. Um, because Black Ops 3 has a lot of modded maps for the workshop. And uh, I, I do want to test a lot of them out. I, I, I really do. But before I do, I need to make sure that I survive this. I, I do not. Nope, 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 nope. Oh, oh this is bad. I don't, honestly, I don't think I'm going to go down anytime soon. I, I honestly don't. I, I honestly, honestly don't. I mean, which is kind of cool because I want to see how much I can actually rack up here. Like, you feel me? And what's also nutty to just put it out there, what inspired me to do, like, zombies way back in the day were, like, YouTubers like Syndicate. Do you guys remember a YouTuber called the Syndicate Project? That dude, in, that dude inspired me to do zombies a lot. Um, it was him. It was, uh, I think it was 402 Thunder. Maybe I'm confusing 402 Thunder with somebody else. Um, I don't think White Boy 7th Street ever did zombies, if I'm not mistaken. But I remember, like, the old, the old YouTubers. Like, you feel me? Like, the YouTubers from, like, 10 years ago. And it's crazy now because YouTubers from 10 years ago, you could tell... Dudes had like horrible mics, horrible cameras and stuff. Like it was it was the beginning of like the digital age. It was the beginning of the YouTube age. You feel me? Damn, yo, you guys are You guys are not letting up. Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. I'm doing this for Roshi Sama. You feel me? Is that it? I love the fact that these zombies get stuck on this rock. Because it makes me do this. Watch, ready? Yeet! Throwing all these empanadas. Damn, you guys are taking some hits. Okay, now, now, you know what? Let me let me go on ahead and just get rid of them the old-fashioned way. All right, perfect. Round 25. Yeah, blooded, blood, guts, and gore everywhere, man. But yeah, so the older YouTubers really inspired me, as well as my good friend Super Saiyan Paul. Super Saiyan Paul is and will forever be, like, my, my early mentor for the YouTube days. Even though over the years... I've been very, I, I've been very critical on him, and I've been very, um, you know, hard on him because there was a time where he kind of gave up on his channel, and that's so unfortunate because that's my boy, you know what I mean? And he let life get to him, he let the influence of other people get to him, and he started caring more about other things than his channel, and it really hurt him. So, you know, it's it's really unfortunate, but you know, he was one of the the only ones early on 
that you know pushed me into doing stuff like you know i i and i, I kind of wish we can actually still do it you know what i mean but he's busy i'm busy and um when life catches up to you it really goes to show like damn time flies like who would i never yo listen i never would have thought first and foremost i would ever be here on my channel talking to you guys right now about some 10 year anniversary like you know what i mean like it's 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 insane it's insane if you were to tell me this 10 years ago i would have been like what i would be where hell no how's that possible you know what i mean million plus subscribers i got thousands of videos on my channel like dude come on i i would have called you crazy i would have been like what me me out of all people like nah there's no way but for this gaming roulette video there are so many games that i would like to do that i'm not sure the placement order in which i'm about to like you know put all these videos in but back in the day we did like slender and minecraft and listen we did a lot and then in 2013 we kicked off the dragon ball renaissance with uh battle of gods and stuff like that so a lot of you guys may remember me from that from that time you know covering battle of gods news and whatever get rid of him is that it i think that should be it right there's one more left yeet how did, how did i miss that all right so let me can i pack a punch i can't pack a punch the ray gun anymore no bro can't pack a punch this either so you're telling me all i'm gonna have is the dire wolf i, I guess i can repack a punch right come on come on all right we have a double a double oh oh we got trent okay thanks trent Thanks for helping a brother out, Trent. Oh, we got max ammo. Yes. Perfect. That's exactly what I needed because I want to upgrade my ray gun. I want to upgrade my ray gun. Now, some of y'all might be asking me, like, yo, Alex, are you planning on doing, like, 10 more years? Listen, <laughs> if, if, if the algorithm does me justice, right, and uh, if we continue to grow, then surely enough, I got way more than 10 years in me. Um, but there, I mean, actually, as a matter of fact, to be really blunt with you guys, uh, there was a time during my, my, my YouTube run where I, I used to, and some of y'all may, may remember, um, some of y'all are probably new, but there was a time from like 2012 up until like 2017, I used to sometimes upload date, like double daily. I used to upload two, three, four videos a day anybody who remembers my channel from back during those times will tell you i used to upload like two three four videos a day sometimes more whether that be for dragon ball super whether that be for gaming update videos gameplay videos like it, it was insane it was such a different time you guys have no idea how different that time was and by the way, if you guys are not following me on social media, Twitter, Instagram, all that stuff is down below. I'm I'm going to keep stressing that. I'm going to keep stressing that. Y'all have to follow me on the socials, man. Let me get rid of these dudes. I yo, round 26. How many? How many? 1,000. Look at that. 1,000 zombies, bro. Jesus. Calling it, calling it a day. As a matter of fact, uh, we got a bunch of crawlers. I want to, I want to, I want to go on ahead and, uh, and, uh, go inside the house. I want to camp it out in here for a little bit, but there's probably a crawler. So oh, there he is. I was about to say, I was like, yo, where the hell is the crawler? Can I pack up? I can't pack a punch all the good guns. Damn it. All right. Well, our last stand is going to be right here. I'm going to put in some work, yo. Put in some work. Go ahead. I'm going to pull a Tyrone Magnus. 10 million subscribers. Can you imagine? I would probably have a heart attack. I'm not even kidding you right now. I, I I honestly believe that is one of my ultimate goals is to get like, you know, 10 million subs or whatever the hell. Oh my god. Oh, whoa. No. Okay. Damn. Well, that was insane. Actually, that was actually, that was nuts. They just swarmed in. What the hell? Well, I guess that's all she wrote on that one. Okay, so listen to me very carefully. When I first started Unreal and Gaming, I went on to do Dragon Ball Mugen, and at the time, I was one of the very few that actually went on to do this, and this is Team Super Saiyan 4 versus Team Super Saiyan God, and I'm trying to focus right now because Super Saiyan 4 Vegeta is literally unleashing a bunch of packs. This is nuts. He, is he, he really did. He took down the entire team by himself. Goku did absolutely nothing. 
Nah, you know what? We're doing a rematch. We have to. So, way back in the day, I used to play the older versions of Mugen, and it was just terrible. It was insane, and, I mean, for the time being, it was really fun, and, of course, seeing the Mugen games improve over time was just phenomenal. So, right now, I'm really trying to steady in to see what I got going on, because I am on Team Super Saiyan God for this one, and I want to see if I can go in ahead and take these dudes down, because this is this is simply keyboard and mouse kind of thing, right? I mean, it's CPU versus player, but I remember way back in the day, we used to do, because they were older Mugen games that allowed you to actually do, you know, just 3v3s, 4v4s, 5v5s in some cases, right? So if you guys were around during 2012, 2013, 2014, you can find those really old, cringy videos of me playing this and just giving my thoughts on what if battles and stuff. And now we're doing it again, except this time instead of, you know, giving you guys some cringy commentary about, you know, what if this person fought that person, I'm trying to survive out here. And this is actually pretty, uh, it's pretty entertaining and it's very, like, fast paced in a way. So I'm really not used to playing stuff like this because it's been a long ass time. But in the comment section below, if you guys want me to continue to do Mugen games like this, then I'm definitely going to do it. I mean, way back in the day, I used to have, like, horrible equipment and stuff. So I want to thank you guys so much, especially, especially those that remember this because I'm not really sure how many of you guys stuck by and I can't believe we actually got the victory here. I don't know how many of the OG viewers are still here watching this, but if you are one of those people, oh my, my eyes right now, my eyes are like just bleeding. If you are one of those OG viewers, I want to thank you so much for just always being here. Like it really means more to me than you think. I'm not entirely sure if I want to continue to do this for the next 10 years because YouTube, the, the journey down YouTube's road was such a long, stressful one, but you guys made it worthwhile, and without you guys, without you guys pushing me and motivating me and giving me criticism and helping me improve, then I wouldn't be here doing this. And this is, yo, I'm really trying to focus in. This is too much for my eyes. The, the red glow, I don't know what the hell's going on with the border. Maybe it's because, I don't know, it's just Super Saiyan 4s versus Super Saiyan Gods. I mean, maybe that's why, I have no idea. But I think the Super Saiyan Gods are about to win. Super Saiyan Gods for the victory. Sorry, GT fans, not today, right? finish all right you know what another game we have to we have to now this would most definitely be interesting we have mastered ultra instant goku we have what appears to be or at least should be dragon ball super's variation of roly against vegito blue and jiren let's see i'm gonna probably vote on goku and broly on this one i was about to say vegito and jiren but i mean i think this version of vegito is kind of busted so let's see but either way the mugen games from way back in the day were insane what is going on right now i think goku's like tanking these guys i think I think Go I mean, first of all, Broly's insane, right? Goku's fighting both of these guys by themselves, right? I mean, just look, now, now we got Broly and Jiren. We got Broly tanking Vegito. Goku's doing something in the corner. Yeah, there, there's no chance. There's no chance. This is insanity. There's no chance. Goku, Goku's strong, dude. Down goes Vegito. And the last person that's about to go down is, wow, Jiren. And Go- why, what the- Goku's- Goku the GOAT just wrecking him dude look at this the, the i mean first of all the beauty right the, having the beauty unfold by seeing broly and goku like this is just insanity so i don't know i mean if things go right and if things continue to progress the way they are or even get better then we have so much more coming your way but I, I, you guys have no idea the journey and, and the stuff that i wanted to do on the channel for such a long time i really wish that i started the gaming roulette series way back in the day goku's a beast in this game he really is i, I want to go in ahead and just what, what is he about to do goku's finishing everybody off i mean at this point i really assumed that this version of vegeto for this movie game was going to be tough I, maybe it's gogeta maybe i'm having the two confused but look at broly he's just leveling the entire field this is i mean but this is why these Mugen games are fun i really want to try to find the older Mugen game i probably still have it on my pc the older Mugen game that allows you to do like 3v3s 4v4s that was insane wow they finished these dudes off quick i can't even believe it that was like a quick victory now you know what we have to get another match we have to just for the sake of Mugen and the history that we have of Mugen on the channel okay so talk about making sacrifices right goku black and gogeta blue versus cumber and merge zamasu i'm gonna have to go with gogeta and black on this one even though cumber and a hypothetical immortal zamasu would be tough to beat especially zamasu since he really can't die so even if i i have no idea what's going on right now I, this, this is just this is just chaos and the reason why i threw in goku black in there is because i want to see if i can have like a rogue goku black going up against zamasu gogeta is just destroying see i think my assumption was right look at that the stardust breaker that's just it's over that that right there would it just eviscerate both merge zamasu and cumber there, there's there's no coming back from that unless of course i think this version of cumber can transform even more 
we're gonna have to wait and see. But I think my money is going to be on Gogeta and Black on this one. I might be wrong. Zamasu, I, yeah, Cumber. Wait, who's the last one? Yeah, it's definitely Zamasu. Definitely Zamasu. Zamasu's fighting both of them. And you know what's crazy? Goku Black would go down, but then, oh wait, Goku Black is, wow, okay. So the, so the finisher came from Goku Black. And see, we didn't have none of this back in the day. If you go back and you search up my old, very terrible audio, terrible quality Mugen games, if you guys go back and look at those, you'll see we didn't have these. We had modified versions of this, that, and the third, but it wasn't anything like this, right? So everything definitely improved, which I'm really happy for. And Merge Zamasu with the jack-off arm. Here we go. Let's see what he's about to do. Goku Black just pushing him back. This is bad. This is bad for the other team. But I, I, I really want to see if Cumber and Zamasu can get the victory. If they can't, then it's going to be a wash. And my eyes right now are burning from this. There's just like so much. See, the, the thing about like you know games like this is it can cause you to have a seizure there's so much happening right now like you have like explosions and you have all types of wow okay wait a minute gogeta and black are about to go down that's crazy i think it was because of monsters attack right it had to have been because so far these other dudes are like I mean, they're, they're relatively good in terms of health, so they're gonna jump Gogeta. They are. What's Zamasu about to do? Oh, he's leveling the entire field. See, this is what I'm talking about. It's over. It's oh, there's no way. Gogeta's still alive. That's crazy. If, if he's yeah, I was about to say if he survives this, then I mean, I I really don't know what else to say. I mean, kudos to him for actually pulling through. But now we have a tiebreaker, so let's go on ahead and see who's about to win this match. I I don't know. Judging if. if Oh, now, now Black wants to go Rosé. If Zamasu does that again, uh-oh, I, I was about to say, if he does that again, it's lights out for everybody. And if Cumber transforms, I'm not too sure about this one. I, I want to see if I can actually pull through and uh, have this be like an even fight. But let, let's just see. Merge Zamasu once again with the jack-off arm. This is insane. This is really insane. But you know what? These Mugen games are so fun. Down goes Black. And is that the end of Gogeta? I think it is. Wait, actually, yeah, is it? Yeah, I think it is going to be. That's crazy. So my assessment was wrong. So, oh man, it's Cumber versus Gogeta. Yep, that's all she, that's crazy. That is really nuts, dude. One more fight. We just have to get one more battle in just to kind of even the playing field here. You know what I mean? Now this is definitely an unorthodox team. We have Hit and Vegeta versus Frieza and Broly. And I really want to see if Vegeta and Hit could actually stop Broly and Frieza. And here's an interesting question. So do you guys believe that Hit's killing abilities or if he were, you know, able to do his job as an assassin without any restrictions, he would be able to beat both Frieza and... Wow, look at this. Well, I mean, would Hit be able to beat them both? Let me know. I don't know. Some people will agree. Some people will disagree. Hit is smacking... Yo, he's smacking them both. Look at Hit. Are you, are you kidding me right now? Yo, he's time skipping them. What is happening? Hell yeah. Yo, he just time skipped both of them. That was so, that was good. That was good. Look at Vegeta laughing. He's like, I, I didn't even have to do anything. That was really good. Kudos, kudos to Hit. That was really good. But now, oh boy, I don't know. Broly's coming back with some fire. Broly's coming back with some fire. And you know what? I want to thank you all so much for just sticking on by and enjoying the Gaming Roulette series because it's a series that is dedicated to just gaming. Just gaming as a whole. All kinds of different games. I don't think you're going to find anyone else that does this. I mean, then again, YouTube is very vast, right? So, Broly, I don't know. This might be uh, that beautiful time skip. I love the time skip so much. I love hits. I, I love hits abilities and his moves. Like, he has one of the best moves, or if, if anything, one of the greatest move sets in Dragon Ball. Like, he has a really interesting style. He has a really interesting way of, you know, going about, you know, fighting his opponents and stuff. So, but what I also want to know is when you guys first found my channel, how old were you? And how many subscribers did I have? I want to know, because some people have been here since the very beginning, like 100 subs, 1,000 subs, and be honest too, you know what I mean? Some people are, are, you know, just came when I had 900,000, a million, you know, 800,000, 500,000, 300,000. I want to know, I want to know how you guys found me. I want to know at what age were you when you found me? And what was the sub number that I had? Because obviously it goes a long way by comparison, right? These dudes are about to die. Like, is this really happening? Unless... Is Vegeta gonna get the victory over Broly? Is he? I don't know. Hit's gonna help him. Is Hit gonna use like a time skipping attack or is he gonna let Broly just, yeah, he's gonna kick him in the ass. Look at that. It's just an ass, an ass kicking machine and he's ending it with the time skip. What a beautiful way to end off this portion of the video. Just fantastic, dude. Okay, so I just started this and already we have like some dude getting his arm cut off. What in the hell, dude? 
I remember when I actually streamed this on my channel many years ago, Jack. Don't. Don't do it, Jack. Jack, no, I don't want to eat nothing, Jack. I, I'm not hungry. Jack? Jack? No, that's that's nasty. That's nasty. Oh my god. Screw you, lady! I don't want to eat, Jack. Y'all remember when I used to play this? I actually streamed this on the channel back in 2007, though. Don't do it, Jack. Jack, no. No! Yo! I wouldn't know what to do in a situation like this. Are you kidding me? That's disgusting. Look at this dude. Don't do it, Jack. Jack, no. Oh, thank God. Look how casually he's just walking away with, like, one arm. You bastard, Jack. Well, I mean, we found out that this was when uh, Ethan died, you know? Following the events of Village. Look at this dude. Hey, Grandma. Ugh, I gotta get the hell out of here. Am I able to, like, let loose? I think I'm I think I'm actually able to. Let me just fall on over. This game used to be amazing. And, I mean, it still is. But having to play this on the channel for the 10-year anniversary, I said to myself, why not? Now, originally, this is Evelyn. Right? I feel like just, like, stuffing some of this meat down her mouth. Or maybe I'll put my meat in her mouth, you know what I'm saying? Alright, so, I know Jack is out there. I completely, I, it's been many years. I played this, like, randomly here and there. Because, I mean, to me, Village is a lot more appealing. But this game has, like, that claustrophobic feel. You, like, you know what I mean? I'm going ahead and just grab some handgun ammo. Do I even have my, okay, I don't have my weapons. Everything is gone. What is this? Uh, state authorities are asking for help for locating three men who went missing. Nope, that is not my job. Nope, I am white, but I'm not stupid white. You know what I mean? For those that are watching this portion of the video, do you guys remember when I streamed this on the channel back in 2017 of January? It was a very special moment because a lot of you guys know me for Dragon Ball and stuff like that. And, uh, oh boy. All right, so there's a hole down here. I'm assuming I can actually open this, right? Um, but I need something to open that with. Okay, so I remember that was a monumental moment on, on the channel back in 2017. And we've gone through so much. I want to thank each and every single one of you that have been here for such a long time. Like, it really means a lot to me. More than you guys think. Now, what is this? Uh, what the hell? Nico's Hardware. All right, so they're spending a lot of money on hardware. Not that I care because, I mean, it's not my property, right? It's some nasty stuff. These dudes are nasty. They're just eating, like, just dirty meat. If y'all have not played this game, which I don't know by now if you just, you you should have, especially if you love horror like me, uh, just get this game. Get this game. It's fun. And then after you play this game, play Resident Evil Village. You guys are, you're not going to regret it. So, 2022, it's crazy. Like, you know what I mean? Like, 10 years on the channel. That's nuts. Hopefully 10 more. Hello? Anybody here? Oh, I remember this dude ripped the staircase out. That's crazy. Is Jack over here? I think he's like out there somewhere, right? I'm actually, I'm, I'm too afraid to step forward because if I step forward, he's going to pop out. That's the last thing I want. Let me see. Let's see. Hello? Oh my God. Nope. Nope. I'm getting the hell out of here. I don't want any smoke with homie. Um, can I, can I do something with this? Damn it. It's fragile. Is Jack making his... Well, I actually, I don't want to find out. I really don't. So let's go on ahead and just uh, come here in the basement. Oh, I, I need my knife. Where's my knife? I don't even have a knife. Oh, this is terrible. Jack's going to kill me. I can, I can promise you guys that. He's going to see that door open, too. He's going to be like, God damn it, boy. He got out. I need my knife. But where the hell is my knife? Oh, crap. Where the hell is Grandma? Oh, that's not good. Oh, that is not good. Um, can I use a fork? What the hell was that? Yo, I hear him. Oh, no, I hear him. And by the way, in the comment section below, I want you guys to comment and uh, let me know. In the last 10 years on this channel, what were some of your favorite games that you saw me play? That is something that I really, really want to know. I've asked you this before, but I'm not sure if you guys skipped specific gaming videos to watch something else but i, I genuinely want to know what my, what your uh, favorite games were that we've played on the channel i mean it could be anything and i can only imagine what some of your answers are going to be um i need to open this like what i mean what do i do i mean i just got i have handgun ammo and i have marijuana like you know what i mean like what, what the hell am i supposed to do oh 
Oh, nah. Oh, look, can I crouch? Oh, God. Hey. Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, no, no. Oh, no, no, no. Nah. Nah, he must have sniffed me out or something. That dude's gonna come busting through the wall. Watch. Guarantee it. Okay, no, he didn't do it this time. All right, cool. Where is he? Oh, my God. Yo, that... Yo, no, he did not. I'm stuck. I have nowhere to go. Please, sir. Oh, God. Did I juke him? I juked him. What an idiot. <laughs> what an idiot. What is this? Why am I rotating this? No, no, no. No, no, no. I'm not, I'm not trying to... Okay, we, we have a hatch key. Okay, oh, great. Perfect, perfect, perfect. Oh, my God. This is our opportunity. This is our opportunity to do this, right? Oh, God. Can we close this? All right, good. Let's come over here. Let's go on ahead and just quickly run over here. Let's go on ahead and use this hatch key. Oh, my God. Open the hatch. Open the hatch. Open the hatch. Oh, God. Oh, God. Yeah. Oh, oh God. All right. All right. Let's get the hell out of here. Ten years on the channel, dude. I mean, come on. Do you hear this? Dude, there's some nasty stuff under here, man. You know what this reminds me of? Do you guys remember that movie that came out last year? The Conjuring? The Devil Made Me Do It? I don't know if you guys saw it, but this, this, is what, this is what it reminds me of. When Lorraine went underneath the house and found, like, that witch's totem. Okay, we have some coins, I suppose. What the hell are we going to do with these coins? See, what makes this game different than Village that was really cool is, like, it's not as grit. Well, this is a lot more grittier. Like, it just feels more enclosed. Like, you know what I mean? It's, it's a lot dirtier. It's a dirty-ass house, you feel me? Oh, there's a cable here. Hold on. Yo, you can hear this dude walking around upstairs. I am so petrified. I do not want him to, like, get anywhere near me. Is he here? Okay, good. He's not here. Uh, what is this? This is a typewriter. Okay, um... The main house map. Okay, so let's just go ahead and grab that. If this dude busts in here... Oh, we got some marijuana. We got some chem fluids. All right, cool. Now, what I need is a knife. And to be honest with you guys, I mean, I don't know, personally, if I want to continue to do this for the next 10 years. Do you understand what I'm trying to say? Because doing this for 10 years on the channel, it's been... Hello? Anyone there? Yeah? Hello? Yeah? Domino's Pizza? Okay, there's there's no signal. All right, great. Uh, you guys have no idea, like, the, uh, the mental stress and all of the things I've been through and all the things I sacrificed... Just to make this channel what it is. You guys have no idea. Oh, oh, what the hell? Oh, is that Zoe? That's probably Zoe. What do you want, lady? Hurry up, pick up Ethan. Hello? You did good, Ethan. Zoe, right? What the fuck are you? Shut up and listen if you want to stay alive. Whoa, whoa, whoa. You gotta get out of that house. Well, and duh. way out through the main hall. All right. Oh, and that thing on your wrist is a codex. Okay. It. It's important. Okay, all right, well. It's crazy how, like, Ethan is, like, a part of the mold and stuff like that, you know? All right, so Jack is out there. Um, I have chem flu. I, I don't, I didn't get anything from here. The only thing that I managed to get was, what do we have in here? Uh, I have a driver's license, and that's about it, really. What the hell am I going to do with a driver's license, you feel me? There's got to be something here. Um, I really need, I need that knife. Because if I were to get that knife, which I'm trying to check my inv yeah, I don't really have it. Okay, so I'm guessing I lost him. There's no way that Jack is still here. There's no way. I'm so nervous right now, dude. But yeah, so I really don't know if I want to continue to do this at the pace that I'm doing it, you know, like within like the last 10 years. Because you guys have no idea, like, you know, the, just the stress that it, you know, just that I had to endure and like just the sacrifices that I made. But I, I'm very thankful that, you know, we've managed to get 10 years on the channel and I'm really, you know, really, really thankful that you guys are still here and have been here for such a long time. Um, can I use this, I suppose? Okay, well, I can't use that. I have no idea, like, what am I supposed to do? I think I'm supposed to, like, move this or something? I mean, I have an antique coin, but that's about it. I need something more. I, I need that knife in order for me to cut through that box and then go downstairs. Now, the reason why I chose Resident Evil 7 was because this is a classic for me. Uh, damn, that, that was them before, like, the, uh, the atrocities went. Uh, Jack and Marguerite's 25th anniversary. That's crazy. This is my 10th anniversary. Look at this asshole. Look at this friggin' Lucas. February 2013. That's crazy. Now, 
there have to be there there has to be clues around here. I'm just trying to take a guess. Maybe maybe I'm not looking into something. I want to see if there's anything behind the picture or if there's anything behind you know something, right? You're going to have to investigate your surroundings if you want to, you know, proceed. But the reason why I chose this game was because I remember when I streamed it, it was one of the only games that was like not Dragon Ball related that so many people enjoyed. So I said to myself, yo, let me go back. You know, like, oh, what the hell? Oh. Hey, over here. Yo, what's good? What up, cop? Help. Bust me out, dude. Hey, you gotta help me. Bust me out. Hold on, back up. What you mean? Now, sir, do you live here? I mean, uh, do I look like I live here, dude? What? Me? No. No. Let me out. All right. Now we got several calls about some missing persons late. Uh, you duh. Understand. Let me out. Get out of here. I calm down. You're not listening to me. Are you kidding me? There are crazy people in this house trying to fucking kill me. Exactly. Like, right. what the hell? Let me tell you this. You don't exactly seem like you playing with a full deck yourself, all right? Is he serious? Look, like I said, we've had several missing persons calls. Dude. And I can't rule out that an outsider like yourself Dude. may not be involved. What you? I'm behind a freaking barrier. That's more like it. Now, meet me in the garage. Oh, no. That's where Jack's hey, going to be. You got to give me your gun. <laughs> oh, he ain't going to do it. Look, officer. Dude, I deputy. need you to help me out here. Right. Deputy. Now, do you want to see my name in the obituaries? Or do you want to be a hero and save my life? Exactly. What you want to do, homie? Is he really? What is that? Oh, it's a knife. Here. Take it. That's all you're gonna get. Now go. Garage. Now. This dude's gonna get got. Watch. He's gonna get got. He's gonna get got what with a shovel. With a knife? Yeah, what the hell am I gonna do with a freaking knife? What am I gonna do? Like, freaking... Just make dinner? Like, come on, man. Alright, uh, let me just chop this. Grab some ammo. The garage. Alright, let's go on ahead and come downstairs. Now, this is where things are going to uh, just get really interesting, right? Let's go ahead and cut this. Jack probably, all, or he knows everything. This dude, Jack, is probably on my ass. On my ass. Oh, God, here they are. Officer, help me. Hey, we gotta get the fuck out of here. Yeah, no, we do. You need to tell me what you're doing out here alone. In the what you mean? Me. What about you? No, it's my job. Yeah, what about you? Don't you do your job and tell me. Answer my questions. You're not gonna believe me if I told you. Uh, duh. Oh, crap. Dude, the freaking door's closing. Whoa, oh, crap. Yo, what did I say? What did I say? You moron. Oh, look at his brain. Hey, Jack. Oh, God. Hey. Oh, gee, his penis. Oh, screw you, Jack. Oh, God. Oh, God. Oh, God. What am I doing? I, oh, don't chill, chill. I was just, oh, my God. You saw that? This dude, like, just Anderson Silva kicked me in my freaking nose, man. You better bet. Yo, I ain't playing with you, bro. Oh, my God. Hold up. Let me. You want some smoke? Oh, I'll give you smoke. I'll give you all the smoke. You feel me? Watch this. Watch this. Come on. Come on. Yeet. Oh, right in the eyeball. Yeah, you don't like that, do you? You hear this, dude? There's only hands one way. Yeah, okay. Oh, God. What am I supposed to do? I need the, I need the key. Oh, that's that's not good. How do, how do I get out? How do I get out? Get out. Get out. Get out. Get out. I need, I need the key. I need the key. Let me just grab this. Oh, he got me. He got me. He's going to slap me. Oh, God. Oh, he missed. What an idiot. All right, let me just reload. So I'm going to get him to come over here. All right, what's what's my status? All right, so, so far I'm okay. Jack was really, like, he reminds me, like, he reminds me of Leatherface so much. Like, you know what I mean? Oh, right in the mouth. Yeah, what you going to say about that, huh? Talking all that doo-doo, aren't we? Huh? Uh-oh, here he comes. Oh, he's, oh, he's quick. Oh hell no, dude! He's quick. Oh no 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 no! I I you need to you need to like you need to chill, homie. You need to like really chill, bro. Oh, what the hell is he doing? Is he really ripping that freaking car? Oh, what is he doing? What is he doing? What the hell is he doing? Oh no! Oh, how do I heal myself? Can I even heal myself? Oh, this is this is bad. This is very bad. This is very. I'm I'm gonna die. I'm gonna freaking die. This dude's gonna kill me. Oh god. He's gonna freaking kill me. Dude, he's gonna he's gonna freaking kill me. Yeet! 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 Oh my god. Am I am I dead? How am I not am I dead? Can I can I combine this with something? Let me see. Combine items with this, I suppose. Let me just go on ahead and use this. Oh lord, what is happening? He's on fire. You 
Oh crap. Oh crap. Oh crap. He's gonna yeah, he's gonna uh, he's gonna eat my pee pee. Look at this. Can I shoot him? Can I like kick him in the Oh there we go. Yeah. Serves you right. Oh, serves you right. Well we all know this ain't the end of it, so. Oh man, look, he's he's on top of me. He's on fire on top of me. I I am inside of him, dude. That's nasty. Oh god, look at this place, man. Yeah, serves you right, Piglet. Let me let me come over here. What's what do we have in here? Do I have anything first aid kit? Yes. What I need, let me just pour some alcohol on myself. Okay, so what I need to do is okay, there's a ladder here. I need some ammo, man. That's what I need. Oh, what in the world, dude? What the oh no. Oh yeah, what am I about to Oh god, no, no! Oh, what a sick bastard. Okay, you proved absolutely nothing to me. The only thing this dude proved to me was how stupid he is, right? So let's get the hell out of here. Ten years on the channel just for you to do that? I mean, l listen, that was what I wanted to do many times. You guys have no idea. All right, um, let me grab this. Can I can I rotate this? Can I take this off? Is it possible for me to take that off? Uh, yes, it is. All right, so let me go ahead and unhook that. All right, wonderful. All right, ox statue, perfect. Yeah, that uh, what Jack did was what I wanted to do so many times due to like all the stress that the YouTube algorithm was giving me and the channel and just a whole bunch of hoopla. All right, let me get the hell out of here. So far, we're making progress. God, we're making progress here, yeah. Let's get the hell out of here, dude. I am not. I am not trying to stick around. I'm not trying to befriend this dude. He wants to he wants to play Kumbaya in the corner. Nope, not me. Not I, says the cat. Alright, can it can is this gonna work? Let's see. There we go. Alright, open the chambers. Let the doors open. God, look at this. Look at this. Shades. Shades of Resident Evil 1, right? Let me go on ahead and check something out real quick. Before I do anything else, I want to make sure I uh, definitely save my progress. I don't want to be caught in the middle of something bad happening with Jack, you know what I'm saying? Okay, so I don't know why that took so long, but we've saved the game. And now we can just get the hell out of Dodge. Let me see, because I, I know this game is like very psychological. It, it's not, I would say, as easy as Resident Evil Village, you feel me? Look at this place. Look at this place. Nasty. Gives me like Texas Chainsaw Massacre vibes. You feel me? Now, I want to get that shotgun, but I have to replace it with like a fake one. So, oh, I remember this. Oh, I remember this, yeah? Uh, oh, I'm supposed to put that freaking thing there. It's, support it's supposed to like morph into like a spider or whatever the hell it is. Can I go outside? No, I can't. The fact that I would be in a house like this. Oh, guys, is, is it Zoe again? What do you want, Zoe? What? Did my daddy give you a hard time? Oh, yeah, he did. Is your father? He used to be. Oh, here we go. I'm sorry, but he, he, he's, a, he's dead now. <laughs> you just might be able to pull this off. Wow. What? Pull what off? There's something I need you to do, but I can't explain it right now. Yeah, she, now. Wants, she wants some dirt, you, you know what I'm saying? She wants some dirt. To do it, but find a way out of the house. That's what she wants. She I'll wants me to go and come on over to her trailer. Give her some dirt, you know what I'm saying? That's all right, Zoe, don't worry. I'm coming, literally. <laughs> All right, let me, uh, some things never change, you feel me? But definitely play this game if you guys haven't. It's, it's, it's really dope. What the hell is all this? Oh, oh, I thought, I thought that was Jack for a second, dude. I was about to say, uh, shoot me, shoot me. Uh, all right, well, nah, I don't want to waste my bullets. Nah, the hell with that. All right, so, let's see. Oh, it's Grandma. I want to shoot her in the face so bad. That's really Evelyn, dude. Look at her. She's like, Arr! Arr! see, th that's that's what I feel like after doing ten years on the channel. You feel me? Like, man, we've done a lot on this channel. I mean, wouldn't you guys say? Do I hear Jack? Oh, yo, that freaking that that fan right there. It keeps like I, I keep thinking that's him. All right, um, damn, we're gonna have to do a lot. What is this? It's a picture. Yeah, that's Evelyn for you. B O W Evelyn. Oh, Evelyn, Evelyn. Now I know Jack is going he's going to appear here somewhere. I think it's like in the bathroom or something like that. You feel me? Alright, it's a helmet, but not sure if there's anything that I can do with this helmet. 
I could put it on, right? I would definitely put on a helmet like this and then just body him. You feel me? Like, there's not much he can actually do. See, this is why this game is great. Oh, what the hell is that? Oh. It's Marguerite Baker. Look at her. I remember when I streamed this. People were going crazy. They were like, yo, Unreal, get the hell out of there. I'm like, dude, she didn't even she can't she can't even see me. She's talking to herself. She's crazy, dude. I, I bet you any amount of money, her vagina probably smells like mustard and mayo. You know what I mean? Like, you got some mayonnaise vag. You guys, she has a mayonnaise vag, that's what she has. She has a mayonnaise vagina. <laughs> All right, so while she goes off to twinkle, and you know, in the uh, in the forest, I need a I need to figure something out here. Um, I'm gonna use my knife. Definitely, definitely running. Okay, I was about to say just right now, I'm I'm running low on uh on ammo, but I guess not not today, right? The staircase. What a what a crazy like. Who the hell rips an entire like staircase out? Like you know what I mean? That's that's wild to me. So, this is where I think Jack is going to appear. I'm going to have to be very careful with what I do right now because he definitely is going to appear. And I'm going to have to, like, really pick and choose what I want to do here. Anyone want to play some billiards? You know what I'm saying? Some pool? What I'm looking for, I mean, what's what? What's with all these freaking antique coins? I'm trying to look for, like, ammo and stuff like that. Like, you feel me? This place is dirty, man. Some dirty... Mia, oh boy, what's in this trash can? Nothing but trash. Oh boy, we have a lot. I mean, th for this for this gaming roulette video that we're doing, man, the ten year Annie. Let me tell you, I mean, I I don't know when I'm gonna you know or where at least I'm going to put the Resident Evil portion of this video. But let me tell you, if you guys have reached this point, then thank you so much for being here. Because I, I, I know for a fact that, uh, what is this? Is the same path? I think it is, right? Yeah, it is. All right, cool. Jack's going to come out. I know he is. He's going to pop out from, like, as soon as I come inside of here. Um, there's nothing in here. Yeah, I knew it. As soon as I drain this is when he's going to pop up and he's going to be like, Oh, what's up, turkey boy? You know, stuff like that. So I'm going to have to be careful. Um, so let me go on ahead and drain this, I suppose, right? We're gonna drain all this mold crap. And now we're gonna, what is that? Yes, collect the wooden statue. Yep, and watch this. Jack is gonna come out of nowhere. That's disgusting. God knows what that is. It's what I'm made of, right? Watch this. Watch this, watch this. What did I tell you? Oh, God. You nasty. Oh, you crazy ass. Let go of me, Jack. Oh, God. He threw me over the tub. Oh, no, dude. Do you hear this nut job? This guy, my daughter gave me a gift. And, and this gift is going to be all... Oh, she's... Yo, listen, I don't, I, I don't care about what Evelyn gave you. Oh, what the hell? Oh, okay, that got me. That got me. All right, nope. That's a waste of your time. Yeah. Come on, Jack. Where you at? Oh, there he is. I'm gonna have to be very careful here. All right, let's just, can we shut this door? All right, good. Because for some reason, doors are like his worst enemy, right? So, now what I'm gonna do, oh, he's cursing me out, look at that. Now what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna circle back around, right? He's probably not gonna see me, or maybe he is, who knows? I'm gonna pick and choose real quick. So I'm gonna wait right here. If I see those doors open, then I'm gonna make a haste over there. Come on, Jack. Where you at? Where you at, Jack? Hmm? Oh, he lost me. How the hell do you lose me in your own house? He's bound to come out. I I, I can promise you that. I, I'm just being too much of a little of a little wimp to go down there. I'm not trying to go down there. Are you stupid? Are you stupid? Why? So you can shove that shovel up my ass? I ain't doing it. Nah, I ain't doing it. Where's Grandma? Grandma's not even there, dude. Oh, my God. Jack? Alright, maybe he gave up. Who knows? 
I'm definitely not going down that pathway. Nope. But I but I have to go save my game. Like saves are always important, at, le- at least for me. If you save your game, you save your progress, you're good boogers. You don't have to worry. And especially if you guys want me to continue this and we can just keep going. I mean, I'm gonna have to, right? So let me Oh! Oh! Oh no. Well, I guess that ends this portion of the uh, Resident Evil video. Holy crap! Okay, so for whatever reason, I wasn't able to get Slender on my PC. I don't know why it kept crashing, but this is Witch Hunt. You guys may know I love this game a lot. Salem Witch Trials kind of vibes. Look at this. Look at this town. Man. We have witches being hunted. Oh, they hung her. They're hunting witches, but I mean, at this point, it's like, all right, well, I would not be caught dead living in a town like this, man. This is just, this is, there he is. There's our homie. I think I have what you need. Yeah, I think I have what you need, he says. All right, so we got 50 coins. What am I going to get? I have no idea. Uh, ammo bag, maybe? That's a lot of money. Uh, perhaps maybe get a silver bullets, maybe? Silver crucifix. Yes. Can we go on ahead and purchase this? Yes, we can. The watcher totem. No compass, not really. The silver bullets pack. Uh, I guess I'll just grab one of these. I have 35 bucks left. What else do we have? For 35 coins, we can't really do much. So I guess what I'll be able to do... I want to get a, a silver crucifix, but... I'll just get more silver amp. Okay, not enough space. Alright, whatever. I, 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 think, I think we're better off the way we are. Okay, so... Let's go on ahead and get the hell out of here. Man, look at this. Let me... Let me uh, what's going on in here? Survivors? Is that what it is? Oh, we have one person praying to God. Who are you? You got any answers You're for me? You're probably looking for Father Ludwig. I am. Unfortunately, he got killed by that horrible beast. Okay. That's why I'm looking after the church. I can provide medical help if you need it. Listen, buddy, I don't, I don't need your medical support, alright? I need the priest. Hey, lady. Do you know where the priest is? Oh man, she looks possessed. Alright, let's get the hell out of here. 10 years on the channel, dude. This game is... I, the, the vibes. The vibes are just there, you feel me? Oh, boy. I think you guys already know what we're about to do, but... Before we do that, I want to go in ahead and explore my surroundings a bit, you know what I mean? Oh, that scared the crap. Is that a bat? Look at that. Look at the size of that bat, dude. We're living like during like the 1300s and whatnot. Let me just... Oh, it's open? Who's in here? Anybody in here? Oh, we have a we have a broomstick. Can we use that? Uh, what is this? Silver bullets. Can't carry any more ammo. I hear like some magical thingy-bajiggy. Where is it? it, it do, we, do I smell weed around here? Oh, I gotta get the hell out of here. Is it this? No? Alright, well, let's get the hell out of here. Okay, so... We're gonna go in the forest. And we're gonna see what's up. You guys may have seen me play this so many times on the channel. It's just so great. Oh, man, she wasn't so lucky. All right, well, let me just go ahead and grab this little glass here. All right, off into the woods we go. When a powerful monster is within 500 meters, I can sense its presence. People say that I possess the ability because the blood of an angel runs through my veins. Correct. I was trained by Whis and by Maris, too. I'm a little nervous, though. I don't know what lies on the other side. All right, here we go hunt down the beast we will do that all right let me whip out my so as a matter of fact uh let me see where's my there we go look at this they gutted that thing um okay so i want to go over there some of y'all may remember this we have the zombie right zombie lady right over there all right look here lady i don't want any smoke i just want to know I just want to know one thing. Who's stronger, Goku or Vegeta? Oh, Jesus! Never mind. She didn't want to give me an answer. The hell with her. Let's go ahead and save this. Let me just reload. All right. Boom. We saved. Now let's go this way. Yo, you can literally hear that freaking wolf, man. It's literally, I mean, listen, it's literally a werewolf. Let me see where he's at. Where, where is he at? Oh, he's looking for me. Yeah, he smells me. He smells my blood. That's crazy, though. I mean, I 
Can you imagine living during a, a time like that? You like, you know what I mean? What is it, like the 1300s, 1400s, 1500s, 1600s, 1700s, whatever it was, right? During the days of the Salem witch trials, all you really had to do was accuse your neighbor of being a witch if you didn't like them, and that's it. It's 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 a done deal from there. Do y'all remember when I did my my uh, my my Halloween specials on the uh, gaming roulette? I might do more of those. Oh, I hear some stuff out there, boy. Uh oh. All right, where you at? Where you at? I know you're around here somewhere, homie. I I ain't scared of you. I got here a musket, yeah. He's around here. That werewolf is around here. Where you at? Where you at, big boy? If he comes charging out from the woods, I'm gonna crap my pants. I mean, you guys have seen it, right? There were several times where this dude came out of nowhere. And I almost caught like 75 strokes trying to like take him on, you know? I feel like he's over there somewhere. Let me go ahead and use this. Where's he at? Okay. Alright, I don't know where he's at. If I can spot a road. Okay, there's fog. Okay, I think I know where he is. I think I know where he is. He's over there. He's gotta be over there. Yeah, he's gotta be over there. Alright, um... Yeah, I, I, I think I know where he might be. He's definitely in this direction. Oh, Mr. Wolf. These freaking birds are scaring the crap out of me. Where you at, homie? If I see anything move out there, I'm shooting it. Well, then again, everything is moving, so I don't know. Let me draw his attention. Yay! That ought to draw his attention. Listen, guys. I'm white, but I'm not like this white. Like, oh. Oh! I got the attention of the wrong animal, alright? Like I was saying, I'm white, but I'm not like stupid 1700s white, you know what I mean? Dost thou not knoweth werewolves are in the woods? That's not, nah, that's not me, homie. I'm, I'm turning the other way. But you gotta give it to all these, like, you know, people from back during these times. They had balls. They had balls. What the hell is that noise? Oh, it's that thing. Oh, God, where is it? I need to get the hell away from it. I can hear it getting louder. I hear marijuana. Where's the marijuana? Yes. Oh, wait, I, I can't. I'm, I'm already fully healed. Whoa. What was that? What was that? Oh, wait, maybe he's over there. Since the fog is over there, you feel me? I guess I'll make my way around. What the hell is that noise? Who wants thou smoke? Shall be shot in between the eyes. I don't know about you guys, but I would not be able to survive during a time like this. What the hell's that noise? I don't like this at all, man. I have to cross the river and stuff like that. Listen, it's been it's been ten years on this channel. I want to assume that games like this, Witch Hunt. They were inspired by games like Slender, you feel me? I know I'm not bugging out. I know you guys hear the same noise that I'm hearing. Oh, it's a bridge. Alright. Whoa. Whoa. Oh, it's that thing. Okay, let me get the hell out of here. What would you guys do during a time like this? Let me know. No phones. No computers, no OnlyFans, no freshly cooked meals, no deodorant, right? None of that. What would you guys do? Let me know. All right, you know what? Aha, I, 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 I know where we're at. I'm going to go, actually, as, yeah, let me go this way. 
And to think, they sent me out here. Like, that's like the worst. Now, they got zombies. They got all types of things around here. So, we're going to have to be very careful. They got like this giant bat thing in the sky. I got to be very careful. I can't even go in the water either because apparently there's something in the water, right? If I go in the water, it's going to just chew me. It's going to chew me apart. Oh, I thought I just saw like a hooded figure, dude. I was about to say. Oh, that's that's not sketchy at all. Look at that. Dust down north wanted to cross this little. Oh, damn. Look at that. That's all. That's like that's like all spiked up and stuff, dude. I, I mean, I can't, I can't, <laughs> I can't cross that at all. Anyone here? Do we got any Satanists in the woods? I got a musket, bro. And the sword. I really doubt this werewolf is anywhere near us. I really, really doubt that. But then again, if this was me in person, I would... Shit, my pants just hands down. Like, I'm just, I ain't gonna lie. Some people are gonna be like, nah, man, you know, I can handle it. Nah, hell no. What the hell is this? Oh, this is the outer regions of the map. Okay. I completely forgot about that. Alright, so. What we're gonna do. Let me see where this, uh, I need 20 mana. Oh, that sucks. Alright, I have 18 bullets left, which I think is good. If I shoot, I'm not sure if I'll get his attention, so. Let me see if I can just do this, right? Come on, come on, come on, come on. All right, good. We didn't freeze to death. And to think, like, in real life, like, the wilderness is, like, so unexplored. You can have, like, a death cult just out there doing some crazy stuff, and you wouldn't even know it, you know what I mean? Got giant spiders here and everything. All right, so... Let me see if I can swap that. I actually have a, I have a pistol too. Oh crap! The enemies in this game spawn randomly. Like everything is like so random. So let's see, let's see what the game got cooking for us. What the hell's that noise? Where is it? Where is it? Where is it? Where are you? I'm not scared. I think I'm getting close. What the hell? Oh! Oh! Okay, never mind. Never mind. I did not... Crap, I did not see that. Oh, damn it. Where am I? Where the hell is the rest of his animal, dude? Oh, nah. Okay. If I'm not mistaken... I think, once again, we've walked a giant circle, right? Yeah, we did. Okay. So now... What is this? I don't know what that is. I, 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 it's Listen, I don't even want to find out, you feel me? Oh, wait, why did I, why did I just do that? Wait, no, damn it. Uh, skills. Yes, my skills. Um, can I heighten these? Well, I, I think I can, but let me... I need a map, dude. I forgot. Damn it. I need mana. I can't even tell where the hell this thing is. Let me... Let me take the opposite route. If you guys remember what I'm talking about. So, near the lake, there's a house. So, maybe... In that house, there's something there. Let me see if I can draw its attention. Hey, wolf! Yeet! Oh my god, the fact that we have to do that is so repetitive. What the hell? Oh, what the? Oh, Jesus Christ! Yo, that... Oh, I didn't even know. Oh, that was... That was... That thing ambushed me, man. You see what happens when you draw attention? But I need the werewolf. Where's the werewolf? Okay, he's in an open field from what it looks like. Oh, he stopped. Hold on. He stopped. He stopped. What's he doing? Alright, he stopped. Alright, I don't know why he stopped. Maybe he's like trying to sense me as I'm sensing him, right? Whoa. There it is! Look at that thing, dude! Oh my god, that thing is huge. 
like my meat. All right, let me get the hell out of here, dude. I don't want, I don't want any surprises. Let me go this way. You know what makes it worse? The animals in the forest. Like, they keep on making all these noises and stuff, you know what I mean? Kind of tends to throw you off. I'm gonna die, dude. I have like 31 health, this is not good. Anyone out there? No? Any sea monsters out there? No? I better not have a horde of zombies come after me. Or like witches. Shoving their broomsticks in my butt, you know what I mean? Wait. Oh, crap. My heartbeat. Heartbeat's getting louder. Oh, boy. Oh, boy. Oh, it's foggy here. Oh, no. Let me go on ahead and save that. I need mana. Anyone here? Oh, okay. I, I can fast travel. Alright, cool. I don't... This is bad. I can't see anything. There's a snake here, if I remember right. There it is. Shut up, you. Is my heartbeat getting louder? I hope not. Alright, now we have a map. Open, open, open. Oh, I can't even open that. Oh my god. It's the black goat. Satan! You better get out of here. I ain't playing with you, bro. Be gone! The f look, look at that. The fact that he ran into the woods. That's such an ominous sign. Alright, well, me being white, let me, I guess, go this way, right? Uh, let me see what's in here. I forgot. Alright, we got some books. Silver bullets. I thought that was... Uh, for a second, I was like, wait. Is that Thor's hammer? I'm trying to use the mana, but I can't... Uh, I don't know where this thing is. I feel like I'm getting close to him. Alright. I believe this is where this was his area, right? Oh wait, no, no. Is he is he going in this direction? Is he in this direction? He could be. Yeah, he has to be. Oh yeah, he has to be around here. Oh god. Get out of here, Satan. Uh oh. What was that? Oh! 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 What the hell was that? Hold on. Oh, I died! What, did, a, did a zombie get me? Oh, that was insane! I didn't even see him! Damn, forget the forget the werewolf! I got bodied by zombies! Now, what better way than to cap off the video than by having Whis versus Master to Ultra Instant Goku first and foremost and to actually transform. So, this game is available on mobile. It's called Stickman Warriors. You guys have seen me play it from time to time. Whis is using his full power. That's not good. Let me see if I can, if I can get the better of Homeboy because now I've mastered UI and I want to see if I can get the better of him. But again, thank you so much for 10 years. 10 years of support, 10 years of criticism, 10 years of your love, giving me a platform to share my passion with gaming, Dragon Ball vlogs, all types of different things. I want to thank you so much for just, you know, sticking on by throughout this entire journey. Weez is looking to finish me off. I, I don't want to end this. I do not want to end this with an L. So hopefully, because right now I'm getting a little too antsy, hopefully Goku, there we go, I was about to say, hopefully Goku gets the better of him. I, I, I want the, uh, the students to surpass the teacher because in this case, you know, mortal versus angel, it's not really going to work in my favor, right? So I, I have a few fights after that. I'm, I'm thinking about doing three, right? So let me see if Goku can get the better of his teacher. Let's see. Perfect. We, we got him. We got it. That's it. It's over. It's over right there. Come on. Come on. All right, whatever. We punched him in the face. 
It, that'll do. Oh Murray. yeah, baby, the rematch. Sorry. Jiren versus Vegeta, except this time, Vegeta actually has the ability to use Master to Ultra Instinct. So let me see. Listen, he's trying to Gallic gun me in the face. Vegeta, have you not learned your lesson from our previous encounter? You know what I mean? Let me see if Vegeta actually has what it takes to transform and beat me, because I'm actually looking to go full power as well. But this... I don't know, this is this is like a smash mouth fight because me and him are up close and personal. So again, I want to thank you so much. Here we go. Full power and boom. Let me see. Let me I I, I want to give him a chance to transform, but not really, right? Um, even if he does have the ability to just transform right now, it's really not gonna make a difference because he just depleted you know his his key so at this point let me see let me see I'll, I'll give him a chance okay so instead of transforming he wants to hit me with the galley gun all right well that's gonna be that's gonna be the end of vegeta i promise you this jiren the mightiest in the multiverse right it's over it's done it is yep it's done one more fight that's all we have left here we go now i said to myself this would be sort of like an interesting little matchup right janemba versus the assassin hit so again thank you all so so very much for watching i really do hope you guys have watched the entire video all the way through if you guys have you guys are legends because i honestly don't know how long this video is going to be i mean the gaming roulettes are always super super long anyway so either way i want to thank you all so much for being here let me see if i can finish off hit by using some of my warp abilities by doing something of the sorts to get the better of him if he stops my heart with that one inch punch or whatever the hell it is that invisible strike that i'm done for so but i'm not looking to end off the 10 year any by having Janemba lose. That's that's already a given. So thank you all so much. If you guys are new, smash that subscribe button. Give this video a big fat thumbs up by hitting that like button down below. It's really easy. One click and you've done your job. So let's see what the future holds. I'm not entirely sure how long I can do this consistently like this, but let's see. I mean, that's all I can really say is let's see. That, that This is the end of hit. That's it. That's all she wrote. Thank you all so much for watching and I'll see you all in the next one. Take it easy, guys.